Talk fast. You have one minute. Because on a Friday night, me have to tune in to Real Talk on Stars 96 FM. Me and you have questions about love, birds, and the bees. Not to mention the ticks and the fleas. So you try tune in on a Friday night between 9 and 12 for Real Talk. At a show we discuss everything real and nothing ideal. Yes, indeed. Welcome, welcome, one and all, to Real Talk tonight. I was just here saying I don't want to be here alone, but because I know I have your company and yours and yours tonight, yeah, I don't feel so alone. And I'm feeling even more accompanied tonight because, of course, my co-host, Prestige, Mr. Smoozik, the one who has the girls weak. On a Tuesday night, oh my gosh, on a Tuesday night, just walked in and I'm like, okay, cool. So I have Cassidy and Prestige with me tonight. Of course, you know, Cassidy is our resident engineer, so he's holding down things for us tonight. And I'm with the man who will be celebrating his Earth Strong tomorrow. Sweet November 27th, 20th, oh, Lord Jesus, 23rd. Yes, so I hope I haven't missed anybody's, you know. I wasn't here last week, so I missed Mr. Williams's birthday. Happy belated, Mr. Williams. Miss Brown, all right, happy birthday, Miss Brown. Sweet November born again. Um, Celia Ropa, I think I missed the date, Lord. I'm getting old, sister, and I forget dates here, so <laughs> forgive me. But all the sweet November peeps out there, pick up on yourself. Gary Bowen from the 161st batch of the Michael College. Yeah, had a birthday on the 7th. That was the day after mine. So big ups to all the sweet November people, them on their birthdays, whether it has passed already. Or if it don't come yet, happy, happy birthday when it comes. Prestige, my dear. I have a wonderful, bunununu, sweet Jamaican kind of birthday. Oh, osh. Hosh photos. But it's good to see you. You're looking really cool and nice tonight. As usual, as, as usual. Some breeze or some juice or something blow upon you or drop upon you or something, you know? Within the last two weeks. Because I haven't seen you in two weeks. But you look good. Very good. It's like you keep, you keep looking younger each, each time I see you. I don't know what it is. So, yeah, the people want to hear you tonight. Likewise, you're looking beautiful. Oh, tonk your tonk your tonk yeah, you. Looking beautiful. Tonks. That dress. Wow. Is that skirt and blouse? That skirt and blouse? Yes, just Whoa. pull it. Just, just pull it, don't it? Sit yeah. by you the right way. Yes, man. Like Proper. a lizard pan a limb. Simple. A long time I'm not here that one. It's like one of them flower gun and them on them time. Yeah. So how you been? All right, you know, I'm good just to, here, you good know. Good to see you. Work you know, this morning. Oh, you work this morning? Yes. Cool, cool, really cool. Mm. Double or nothing, right? Mm. I, I can tell you I've had a very interesting week on many levels. Of course, um, I'll tell you a little bit about the week when, when, we, when we get back from um, probably our first break and after doing the in-house matters, all right? So... Let me give you a little bit about what to expect tonight in mm. terms of those numbers to call us on, the social me media acknowledgements, of course, and then we tell you a little bit of what's to come. All right, so tonight we want to hail up all our peeps who are locked in and watching via the World Wide Web. Of course, this is Styles FM Radio. One world, one styles, one styles, one world, and of course, the world listens so all our friends who are overseas and are locked in right now yeah ooh, ooh. good to see you good to have you on board viewing in and listening to the show yes, again. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> something's come once <laughs> and of course our friends right here in jamaica who are locked in as well or are watching in or listening in we are glad you're on board with us tonight it's a pleasure serving you and it's a pleasure being here to work for you and to educate and entertain you. So all our friends in Portland, St. Thomas, St. Anne, St. Mary, 
on a large and in charge and you don't know styles we say all right of course mommy i saw her earlier she's not doing so well and daddy not so well mm -hmm. but you know with prayer and faith keep strong yeah and of course before you know it you'll be back to normal all right guys big ups of course to uncle barry as well whom i had the pleasure of seeing today and nail and a few cousins right big up on herself that country yes man i mm -hmm. had to take a run and run country. back yeah yes rush there and rush come back oh yes yeah we have a center mass yes so big oh. ups to all the the friends and family up there and um let me give you those local numbers now the local number rather the local number for uh, the studio here it's 876-453-1444 right and the overseas number is 9543387973 so if you're overseas and you want to call in that that's your number guys 9543387973 and of course the on the go USA number is 7128322 2772 and the UK on the go number 0330606 and if you are in Canada that number on the go 6479579637 and let me say shout outs now to our social media people there's a, there are some persons who, who, who just watch via the world wide web whether it's twitter youtube sorry the facebook live i mean and of course they will follow us at on twitter and um instagram and all these things so we appreciate that and of course they watch the show on youtube so if it is that you are not able to catch the show live then of course you can see it post dated on youtube go to styles fm radio and for the live feed, however, you can check out Styles FM 96.1 on Facebook and go to the fan page. So all our Facebook live peeps who are locked in already. Yeah, we're glad you're on board, all right? And Twitter fans, you can follow us at Styles, Styles at Styles FM 961. That's Twitter at Styles FM 961. And for Instagram, follow us at Styles FM. M. Okie dokie. Hmm. I had a thought in my head just now. It went for a mm. moment. But oh, it yes. soon come back, I'm sure. And our friends in Brooklyn and in the Bronx. Of course, you know Brooklyn is 91.3 FM. Yeah. Those radios, of course, those dials, broadcast styles. And 102.9 FM in... Let me get that again. 91.3 FM in Brooklyn, 102.9 FM in the Bronx. And if it is that you wish to WhatsApp because you're not so bold yet to call in and you want to send a message, of course, your SMS number locally is the 4531444, as well as the WhatsApp text message only. We are unable to accept WhatsApp calls on the local connection. All right, guys? So... Please feel free to indulge. The show is for you, right? So indulge and full participate tonight. And let's hear the views because guess what? We could very well just be helping somebody else out there. All right. Um, Prestige. Yes. Did you, have you ever gone across probably five, six parishes within a week or so? Yeah. In a week? Yeah. Because... No, listen up, listen up. Not in a week. In several days. But do that in a... Two days. Well, to be <clears> honest, <throat> to be honest, not in, I, I won't two say in days. a week because <clears throat> when I did it the first time, mm. I did it again four days after the first time. Drive. And then... I did... So I, it's, like, it's like over three days. Yeah. So I'm pretty much... I mm. pretty much covered mm -hmm. in in the three days mm -hmm. saint thomas mm -hmm. inclusive um I left portland mm -hmm. i set, went through saint mary mm -hmm. i um kingston yes saint catherine yes clarendon mm -hmm. manchester like seven mm -hmm. so 
You wait, call wait, that, wait, that wait, an wait. extensive traveler, right? In two days. Roughly three, because three today days. I did St. Thomas. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Listen, How will you? Listen, you tell the people that you're busy. You have to be 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 busy. You went on a vacation? No. Or you went on a tour? No. That's the worst part. You have part. to do it work. Exactly. <laughs> 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 it was work. I wish it were. I uh, wish it had been the, the but, vacation. You know, but but no, you, no, no. You know, you have people here say, boy. Why, Lady Clear, live life at Jamaica, oh you boy. Oh, <laughs> boy. I, I wish I had a vacation. Yeah. Hey. Nah, it was not yeah. at all. It was mm. work, and mm. then it was an emergency. Yes. So you understand what I'm saying? Yes. It's like I still work. Yes, yes. So, of course, I want to say big ups to the yeah. NCEL staff. Mm. They are a real mm. good bunch. Mm. Or what you call a good cookie. Yeah. Yeah, real but I, I did it. customer. Not to cut Friendly, you. customer service oriented kind of people. Yeah. yeah? But not to cut you. Mm-hmm. I did it three times. Really? You you went parish upping? Jove around Jamaica. Oh, that was that was a vacation. Well, three times. Yes, man, I mean, it I mean, was. Map, I mean, just Hey. Stick out some little places. So stop at different some spots. Places oh, and stop and you want some domino. You know more? Some you know what did we, that? We, we stop and play. We, we stop all and that play th- some domino. All that thought, because I we carry you alone. Some domino. It's you now 9.30. Th- <laughs> hold on, the dear. We're coming the back wee. to that. Listen to the we. It's, it's 9.31, <laughs> and the time is brought to us by VJ Printing Services, and Real Talk is sponsored by Native Audio Stage and Lighting. We soon come. Yeah. Architects, draftsmen, and surveyors, get your drawings printed in high-quality professional standards. We can satisfy your printing needs. Whether it is for presentation to your clients or for submitting building and subdivision application, make it VJ Printing Services. Whether drawing by hand or with computer-aided softwares, we will plot your negatives and print the copies as you need. We do high-quality white paper printing that is water-resistant and never fades, unlike traditional blueprint. For more information, call VJ Printing at 893 Some say that Zika, Dengue and Chikungunya are found in water and that by drinking the water we can get infected. But that's false. Zika, Dengue and Chikungunya are transmitted through the bite of a mosquito that breathes in stagnant water. Protect yourself and your family. Yo, this is Jati, the reggae ambassador. Join me alongside Jati Jr. Right here on Styles FM. Each and every Saturday from 1 to 5 p.m. For the reggae ambassador entertainment show. I'm going to take you on a musical ride in a yard style. Coming up, Scat, Rock Steady, and oh yeah, we'll rock you from old to new. Roots, culture, and in a dance hall style, Lily, Lily, Lee. And remember, each and every Saturday from 1 to 5 p.m. For the reggae ambassador entertainment show. Check it out. Right to your Styles FM. Yes. Are you sick of living an average life and tired of just getting by? Do you want to take your life to the next level? Learn the secrets of the super successful. Listen to Power in a Half Hour with Coach Mark this and every Wednesday night on Styles FM from 9 to 10 p.m. Learn the habits of the super successful and how to make these habits work for you. Learn to turn your dreams and desires into reality. You can win in the game of life. Let Coach Mark show you how every Wednesday night on Styles FM from 9 to 10 p.m. Planning a party, club night out, stage show, a gospel concert, or even a business sales event? Let Styles FM be a part of your promoting tool. Take advantage of our low-priced promotion packages with commercials, interviews, giveaways, reviews, and much more. We have special offers when you mix and match and bundle your options. Contact us at 876-286-9216 or 439-5160. Styles FM for the most effective way to exploit your marketing dollar. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, now offering stage, lighting, and trust systems for your small and medium-sized events. Whether it's a stage show, concert, drama play, wedding, street party, or club setting, you name it, we'll bring it to life. Call us at 871-5212 or 844-6531. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, a sponsor of In the Know of the Law with Sergeant Adele Rose Green and also Real Talk with Lady Cleo and Daddy Rude. The views expressed on this program are not necessarily the views of Native Broadcasting Network or Styles FM. 
got that right welcome back to real talk ladies and gentlemen <clears throat> of course you know the show is rated a and a for adults only right so of course we have no children listening to the show and that is the reason why it's a night show adults only so we want the adults to participate if you're under age you should go find a book to read or go watch some tv relax your brain uh, or go to your bed yeah better yet <laughs> all right um so prestige you've been you've been island upping you said we yes i take it that that was a lucky lady I thought you bypassed that now. No, we're not bypassing. We want to know. The ladies out there want to know. They like the mix-up. The ladies out there want to know. It's just, I mean just the facts. Ladies. I mean the ladies. <laughs> Your ladies the, on the, air want to know so that they can probably book the next yeah. time you go island up, parish yeah. upping, they can book their, 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 their space to come with you. But they already know. They because, already know. Yeah, because remember, it's not, this is not the only show me have, you know. I know, right? Yeah. Your smooth show. Yeah. I'm, I, and I and I talk about stuff like that on the other shows. Okay. So if All you right. want me to just Aye. tell them something else, I don't Aye. have a problem. Aye. What more do you want me to I tell I will him? tell you before the show ends. <laughs> <laughs> we see Andrea from Ampton Court locked in already. Good night to you too, my love. How are you? Hmm, not sure who's doing the show tonight. Well, it's your girl, Lady Cleo, and your guy, Prestige. Yes. Okay? Yeah, I'm here. All right. Andre. Hmm, yes. Let's see what Andre is saying there. Roan in Calgary, Alberta, and Sadie, Mama Sadie, locked in. <clears throat> oh, it not broke down tonight. You hear, Mama? Mm -mm. No broken down. Of anything tonight, mm -hmm. <laughs> Andrea. So, mm. good, good to know you're locked in. Mm. Um, but, you know, there are some things that every day I'm like, like, what's new? Meaning, what else is going to really happen to, to just blow your socks off or knock your socks off? Because some issues have been plaguing our society. And... Mm -hmm. It's like getting from bad to worse to worse. And not only are children dying, not only are young people seeming like they're possessed with devil, devils or spirits, but adults in some sphere too, I don't know. It just seemed like we have developed this or we, well, let me say develop because or developing because it's continuous yeah this aggressive culture this aggression no more calmness and peaceful way of dealing with issues the quickest thing you can find is two young men on the street sometimes a little a little issue turn us into a big squabble and war and weapon and we've gone to that place where we just cold and colors mm -hmm. and not any much different from the man out there who is pushing down an illegal weapon and hurting people mm -hmm. because the quickest thing we find among ourselves women are doing it maybe not as prevalent as the men but it's happening with women too like the footballer who lost her life carelessly you know unnecessarily um young well apart from the ones who get sick Oh, that's another story. Young people losing their lives too. We really want to, let me just stop to pause to express our deepest, deepest of sympathy to, oh, oh Lord, um, this sister and I would say um, colleague and church sister from Fair Prospect Primary School. I hope I got that, that name right. The school's name right um lost her son um Which tragically he's from portland, portland? there yeah she's from portland portland okay. um miss newville okay and her son a young man 20 years old uh you know lost his life tragically in kingston i think it was sometime last week he's just 
pathetic how wanton these wanton criminals just think it's okay to just cough away people's life for, for material possession it's pathetic mm. and our deepest sympathy of course the entire teaching fraternity um of course i know ministry government officials um this is just one of the cases that we know about there are other cases that we might not be aware of there's a young man who a little boy it's alleged who committed suicide his mom is from region two and i know all the family and friends immediate family of um this this education officer is having a warm time i know the entire parish is trying to come to grips and terms the mom the dad i'm sure they're having a warm time so of course again she would have had an encounter with many teachers across the whole spectrum of region two so again region two is suffering as a result of you know tragic loss to their families so our deepest our deepest deepest condolence going out to mrs grant um from the ministry of education region two may god keep you comforted and the family comforted as much as possible and you know allow those memories so good memories that you've created to to keep you afloat as best as possible but the the, the peace of god which passeth all understanding i am sure will guide you through this very 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 difficult time a very difficult time hallelujah um praises yeah, there, there, there are so many, there's um, so many depressing things media. happening. Social media, where we left off, they press something now. Yes, I mean, I want to break it down. Yes, yeah, the, this, you know, but the, but there's another depressing one on the social media thing now. With the teacher, with the teacher. Yeah. Me, me, eh? me, me you as, as a loss teacher. as a teacher, believe yeah. me, believe me, and I can tell you this, I don't know what transpired prior to that incident. Yes. I don't know what resulted after the video, or after the video, I should say. Yeah. I don't know what's triggered or caused this incident. kind of rhetoric and this incident, mm. but I know it's bad. Yeah. It looks really bad. And for those who might have seen the video, I know that children can ring you and twist you sometimes. Mm -hmm. And draw you out and stress you out because sometimes they come from home with all kinds of stuff. Yeah, but you as a teacher, you are there to, to, to guide them on exactly. the right path. Exactly. And you know yes, I mean? and I'm not finished, yeah. you know, I was getting to the point where I'm yeah. saying, yes, I know that they can test your feet. Yes. And really badly too because mm -hmm. I've been to that place where they test me. And many teachers can attest to it. And then if it tests Lady Clear, why do them? <laughs> <laughs> but I'm, I really, really have to come to the point of the but. Where in 18 years, and there are people who have been in the system way longer than me. And there are some who haven't even been there half as that, that time. But I can't ever recall going to the play that place how do you allow a student a student to draw you out like that to draw you out to that place where mm. you actually threaten because the threats were yes. hurled yes and yes you might find teachers say yeah idiot we do this for or whatever whatever yes but all in all for me i could be so wrong you see and people might have different views, but for me, despite the videoing which the child did, which some argued, I heard under the news, some, was, uh, some persons were arguing that the child shouldn't have any phone, whoever was videoing shouldn't have any phone in, in the school. Mm -hmm. Yes, that might be so, but it doesn't change the fact that the videoing of the incident did not cause the person to do what they did or mm -hmm. said, said what they said. Mm -hmm. Yeah? And... Children being rude or provoking her and mm. whether he knew it was being videoed or not and the things mm. he said still shouldn't mm. allow 
I mean, no, I don't mean, no. think she should have allowed yeah, because these are to things. get to that place. Because, you see, this to and fro, to and fro, chances are it could have caused her to even do things that she never even want to do. Because she got so angry. Yeah, but but these are things that happen behind the scene you know, that we don't get to see sometimes. And it's, it's, yeah, it's... All that thought. Yeah. All that thought, darling. Okay. We have a caller on the 954. Hello, caller. Welcome to Real Talk. Good night, Cleo. How are you doing? I am good, except for my the disturbing video I saw of one of my colleagues. Well, look here. You started out on such a bright, bright note about your round the country trip. I wanted to hear more. <laughs> <laughs> look here. It was, then, if I give you more, you'd cry shame on me because it, was, it wasn't all that at all. It was business, though. No, but, 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 but listen, Cleo. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I, I have been in 24 in one day, twice. I have been to all the parishes except one, except, well, the first time when I was like eight, nine years old. I've been to all the parishes except St. Thomas and Portland. Uh huh. And maybe about 15 years ago, me on my own, me drive around the whole, the whole country except, except, um, except St. Thomas. Mm hmm. Yeah, because one day I'm at Kingston, I'm, I'm, I'm so good to check out Cathy at Mantigo Bay. Where are you, man? Yeah, and <laughs> after stopping here and stopping here and stopping Aye. almost every, every year, mm -hmm. I'm in Mobile, like in the night. My girl, my girl told me, say, or, or somebody answered the phone and said, my girl is not available. Aye, ouch. So, yeah, ouch. So rather, 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 than, rather, than to, rather than spend the night at Mantigo Bay at that time, let's drive from Portland. Oh. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, 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 so that was that was almost almost all the parts. Oh yes, oh yes, it was, it was, brother. Yeah, so so it's not it's not such a um, challenge or a task to go six seven. If you one, never one, get one. to enjoy it while you're doing it, then that's a cha a task and a challenge, son. Nah, man, enjoy it, man. Uh, you enjoyed it, despite not, like, not getting your girl. But I didn't quite get the chance to. That's my point. <laughs> no, no, but, but but apart from that, apart from that, there, there were other other adventures along the I'm way. I'm sure uh, for you there were, but for me there weren't. Oh, the best part oh. of it, I think, was the the, the 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 sessions that I did and the two ladies, Moyley. Um, Williams, that I, Moily Rebo Williams, that I was with, and Julie Bailey. Oh Lord, I forgot her married name. I know that, that Williams. Don't want that. Don't want that. No, it's not I Williams, you know, Lord. It's, it's a Williams. woman named you call, don't want to hear that. So you can continue to see her. Oh, forget Julie's I, last name, Lord. Oh, you know, so many interesting in the name later. I want you. They're both married no. women, I'm sorry. No, don't want to hear the gossip. They're taken. You want to hear the gossip. Be safe and yeah, your people them go down there. No, I said business. What are you? <laughs> mix up, mix up, Dan Dan. Business, work related uh, business. You think you think you think you think that was me? Why 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 hear more? Well, I can tell you, had it been a pleasurable uh, one, I might, might not have said anything uh, at all. <laughs> Cause you know how discreet clear can be, right? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. Anyway, oh, boy. All yeah. right, my dear, keep it locked. Cool. Um, <coughs> yeah. So I don't know what the child was saying, and like I said, I yeah. can't give a full view, my view, full view on it, not knowing what the child said. But despite what the child even said, just either ask the child to be excluded from your class, calling you, you know, discipline. If you see where the child is provoking you, yeah, call for the principal or your HOD, something, and ask the child to be excused from your class. Or if it is that you need to step out for a moment or something like that, step out but where you can see them. I don't know. And if it is, somebody's saying that, that the teacher seemed depressed. Well, the person says, mm. clear, the teacher is. I don't mm. know what mm. proof you have, Kimoy, but, but, that the teacher is or, yeah. right? But... If it is that this teacher was depressed, then I think the teacher would have the obligation, it, it's her obligation or her right to seek the relevant help. And she's entitled, I'm sure, to casual leave 
and entitled, of course, to sick leave. So if it is that you know that you're not in a frame of mind to function among maybe what you might have in your class as rowdy students, they didn't seem quite rowdy to me. I heard talking and stuff, but you could hardly mm. hear the person commenting mm. and responding to the teacher. I could yeah. hardly hear him on the video. Yeah. And he didn't sound like an aggressor. At the same time, we don't know what transpired days before, whether on, from the children's pers, um, standpoint or from the teacher's standpoint. We don't know what caused this particular child to, 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 to video on that day. Was this happening before? Or had it, had hap had it happened before where the child decided, no, man, this is going too bad No, Let me video her when she blow off again today. If it is that a teacher is depressed, don't come to school where the generation X when only tip you over and trigger it even worse. Yeah? Take the time off that you might need to get your headspace back together. But them, they cannot threaten the picnic. Tell me what I read at school. Yeah. And I never threatened them. I couldn't afford to. Yeah? I couldn't afford to probably even say what I didn't want to say. Because in the back of my head, me and say, boy, you know say. After all is said and done, when 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 push comes to shove, I'm gonna get it wrong. I think sometimes it's just the environment with with, with and the era where certain type of student there. It could and be and it could be that you know, they are also era, yeah. going through their 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 issues too. Yeah. And I'm not saying that she's right, you know, but I'm just saying. I know, why we're looking at all, we're looking at all yeah. the, 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 the variables. Yes. Why she trigger up on a level? There? And is it the first she's triggering at that time? At I that level? Again too. You know, mm. and do you really? Because she started out the class mm. sounding quite okay. The young lady come in. I see, I saw um, a young lady. A, a Before student. the student came in, she was having the class because I heard her talking. Before, yes. And then and the student come in, a girl. I and, don't know what she some, said to her some either. Paper, some paper, some paper, and and, 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 and she said something to her, and she went. Give back it back out. to. Give yeah. it back to whatever, whatever. Give it back to whatever. So like we said, we don't know what happened yeah. before that. And but then, then the little boy, the little boy the said young something. man, said something. And and all of a sudden, the teacher well, just she, she tell, like, about mother. So was she whatever that. come before? Something like yeah. you tell lie or something like that, and yeah. she she said, "We are short of her. Mm. We are, we are, and she just we are, we, like your mama." She just trigger off. You know, and a little boy was apparently saying, Yeah. She tell him about his mother. Yeah. And she was getting she got defensive to say, Yeah. Tell about your mama. Saying, if it look like your mama, is it telling you about your mother? Mm -hmm. And she went on in, in that. Trigger. But but I think quan. it I don't know. I think it way overboard. Way, way overboard. Way overboard. To me. And apart from the parts where she was saying, yeah. if you don't have no if you don't have no reasoning ability or you can't yeah. reason. Yeah. No, 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 come in here. In like, class. In class. Yeah. If you can't, because she yeah. never, she's saying, yeah. she never telling about, about him, mother. She only said, if I look like your mama. Yeah. And I heard the young man at one point saying, no, tell me, no, bring up my mother. Mm. In a, like, no, converse, like, whatever we are talking about, no, bring up my mm. mother. And I guess that got him. And. But when I hear the young man attack. No, like, we don't. You know he was mean? talking. He was talking. And chances are, he could have been saying. provoking her yeah. too with what he was saying. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Because she seemed to have just yeah. escalated yes. to an extent, and yes. the, the the part that really know made me. Part, they were yes, in because I have had to raise my yeah. voice as a child before. Yeah. Right, and I've had to let them know that don't 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 go there. Yeah. Don't talk to me like that, or yeah. don't whatever whatever. Yeah. You know what I mean? But the, the, the language, the rhetoric, may we, uh, may we, may we, may we whatever, may we, don't may you, we, whatever, we, whatever, yeah, and yeah. come head no. Good. Ed, something like that. Yeah. Paraphrasing a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But in essence, yeah. a, yeah. and at one point, she was just so, seeming so irate to an extent. She had a staple in her hand, and I didn't know if the boy, and she said, you know what, come to my class. Mm. And the boy said something again, and. So then let me talk, come out of my class and let me say to you again, you know, come out of my class. Because maybe maybe yeah. maybe we're XYZ. Don't you know this yeah. S yeah. Yeah. Well, you should use an S word and S mm. word. So mm. it, it was too much. Uh, let me, let's see what the comments are though. Um it, it's it's disgraceful. Yeah. And I'm really, really sorry that it really had to go to that place. Mm. And I wish if the children had complained about if, if it happened before, I wish they had complained about it so they could have sought some help for this teacher. Because seemingly Something wrong. I really think 
Um, it would have seemed like a grade between grade eight, nine, mm. seven, eight, nine. They were about. It didn't seem much. Mm. Well, I, I'm not sure. Cause you know you have small children and some big children in, in different mm. in lower grades. Lady Cleo and Prestige, Ailings. Good night to you too. Boy, Cleo, it was a disgrace. And the principal couldn't even answer straight in an interview this morning if he had issued an apology to the mother. If he had issued an apology to the mother. Um, boy, poor Princey. Princey is supposed to feel like he didn't want to sink under the mm. earth. Yeah, because mm. Princey probably never expect that. Um, another person here, Sadie, says... Um, Cleo, my mother was a basic school teacher for 40 years. Wow. But that time, the belt used to talk, and children was way back different. Yes, in many regards, I'm sure they were. Uh, we have a caller here on the 453. Hello, caller. Good night. Welcome to Real Talk. Hello. Bless night to you. How are you? Hi, Donald. I'm good. How are you, sir? I am just here. I am on the road. I am, you know, I just pull over and so say, let me see what's going on at Style tonight. That's good. That's good. Have you been able to see that video? No, I haven't. Like I said, I was driving. Oh, okay. So I just stopped and I said, let me see what time it is. Mm -hmm. And then just say I hello to my good friend. My okay, friend, me like that. <laughs> All right. Hey, I wish part you stop. Can we, which part you stop? That we can know which part you stop. How will you stop? Oh, who fast now? Stop. stop. Uh, no, man. In Kianoa, I'm a friend. Oh, all right. Yeah. Stopping at the Migla Village, right in front of Village Mini Mart. Okay. All right. Oh, yeah. And I, I, and I yeah. stop with a lovely young woman. Ay, 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 ay. You're on a date. No, I'm not on a date. I just stopped with the love of my life. Oh, oh my gosh! God. You go, Donald. <laughs> I am sure real talk led yeah. you to, the, to finding that lady. Am can I we, right? Can we say good night uh, to that young lady? Say good night, young lady. Good night, my lovely lady. Yes, good night, my lovely lady. <laughs> <laughs> You're in good hands, my love. You're yeah. in good hands. The love of Donald, life. But when I when I get home, I'll call you guys back. I'll I'll, I'll see. What's the topic for tonight? Boy, is a when you go home, you try to tune in. We don't tell we you. Know, we know it's all like a foreigner. Oh, you must speak so. Hey. <laughs> it's all like a foreigner. Oh, you speak so. Why well, I may mean, I tell you? <laughs> well, the female bring out the good side of me. Tonight. Yes, yes. We hope you'll be able to find the time to listen when you get home. Hi. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm going. I'm alone. I'm a gentleman. <laughs> All right, Donald. Catch you later. <laughs> All right. Cool. But it's a very interesting topic. So tune in. All right. Yeah, man. No problem. All right. Bye, yeah. lovely lady. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my God! I just love these moments. I tell you, boy. Well, you know, yeah, you know, I boy. love them. I love them. I, 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 you mix up the other. I'm a lover, easy? you know, not a fighter. You think you're easy? You think <laughs> you're easy? <laughs> Lord, this one says, um, Cleo, the teacher is depressed. Both were wrong, indeed. Mm -hmm. I, I agree. In today's school system, a man and a woman teacher, a man and woman teacher, a teach now. Can I tell you for true? Can I? Because I want that. Tell me off one day, you know, mm. at primary school, you know, eventually came around at some point in time for help from the same teacher. And I helped him. Come and say, poor you. You know? Yes. Um, hello, caller. Good night. Welcome to Real Talk. Hi, good night. How are you, sir? I'm good so far. Yes. What's your take on the issue that we are addressing at the moment? I've seen that video. It's very unfortunate. Very unfortunate. Uh, um, the fact that she calmed down and could be able to explain herself so much, she could have done better. I did not see the explanation part, but I probably, hopefully, hopefully I'll see it sometime. Yeah, she has explained that the, the, girl, the boy has been disruptive um, to the girls and she sent the girl, apparently made a report, the girl made a report, which he sent over to the principal. Yes. And then 
the girl came back and the boy was still abusive to her. Mm-hmm. I, well, we didn't hear the boy, but she said, and she asked him to leave and him still continue and he shouted at her and that's why she, react, she asked him why he shouted at him. But to the extent that she yes. go, I think she, she passed the mark. She could... Be, she's not the only teacher that suffer these kind of things. True, true, true. There's a lot of teachers that suffer in that are more. As a matter of fact, I work at a school and there's sometimes that, that this is where the children them dry out to a point. Yes, yes, yeah, indeed. One, one day I act out in front of the principal, but I didn't, because I just tell the guys the language that they understand. I have to tell him, say, don't talk to me, because it's not your mother. And your father, that's your father you're talking to, not the parents. Mm-hmm. Don't talk to me like that. And so, you see, but she went too overboard. I think when she referred to those words as describing as murder and those things, I mean, yes, that's too, too far. And then she, after she spoke, after her and explained for, for acting out. If she continued acting out, I would say, well, yeah, she really depressed and really depressed and pushed her to the edge. Right? But she managed to recuperate back and explain herself. So frequent that the guy could bother so she could have control. Yeah, and you know This is what is happening throughout. Yes, and we have to be careful and cognizant because these children, despite them knowing that children around them are disruptive, despite them knowing that the children sometimes really push to the very extreme they are not looking at that what they are looking at is the fact that this person is the adult and she ought to have known better because she's a trained teacher mm-hmm. exactly and the and adult in the situation so she shouldn't allow this child to ring her to that place definitely not this then again some will argue that this woman that like any other he's a human being it's a human being but and over time provocation you know, I think some other intervention should have taken place to prevent this child being there all the time, provoking, provoking, provoking. Because you have children, you know, sad to say, who have been provoked in school, and the moment they retaliate, all kind of disaster occur. They too are humans, in the same way any teacher is human. You know, but the distinction comes because she is the adult. And I think, as you said, she could have done better. It's just a pity she hadn't done better. As a professional, she should have. Right. But I hope this will set a precedent that it's not further up in, in any other. I hope so too. And the teachers will be mindful that many of yeah. the generation X of whom we teach set out to destroy and not to try to fix issues or try to, to even talk to their fellow schoolmates and classmates. They more tend to want to perpetuate the behavior or promote the negative behavior. And then at the end of the day, the teacher gets the blame in all other situations. So we have to be very sure. careful. Sure, we have this conflict resolution. We, we, I hope this helps, the positive chance to come out of it, that it helps to have better conflict resolution in all cases in other areas. Yes, and... We are past the 10 o'clock break, so we got to cut. You take care. Okay. All right, my darling, keep it locked. It's 10.02, guys. The time is brought to us by VJ Printing Services. And Real Talk is sponsored by Native Audio Stage and Lighting. Don't go anywhere. Architects, draftsmen, and surveyors, get your drawings printed in high-quality professional standards. We can satisfy your printing needs. Whether it is for presentation to your clients or for submitting building and subdivision application, make it VJ Printing Services. Whether drawing by hand or with computer-aided softwares, we will plot your negatives and print the copies as you need. We do high-quality white paper printing that is water-resistant and never fades, unlike traditional blueprint. For more information, call VJ Printing at 8 Eight nine three two two six six. Good day, driver. You notice that you're parking in a no parking zone. You know, so you can get a ticket for this, sir. Really, officer? But just want to pick up some hardware supplies, you know. Do me a beg you. Give me a blind, huh? So if you need hardware supplies, why you don't go to Ramtula Super Center and hardware? Ramtula Super Center and Hardware, 34 Folly Road, Port Antonio, Portland. We stock a wide range of products at the best price.
prices in town. At Rampolos Hardware, experience the three C's. Comfort, competitive prices, and convenience. Rampolos Supercenter and Hardware. Opens 8 a.m. to midnight, seven days per week. Call 715-5132. Email rampolosupercenter at gmail.com. Remember, we have the best prices in town. town. Don't miss the adrenaline rush with the musical ingenious Digital T. Saturdays, right here on Styles FM from 4 to 8 p.m. Remember the uprising artists and new music segment from 5 p.m. to 6 p.m. Also, mix journal hour from 6 to 7 p.m. And the party hour from 7 to 8 p.m. Come, Styles FM. <laughs> Digital T. Our brain. Look, huh? Planning a party? Club night out? stage show, a gospel concert, or even a business sales event, let Styles FM be a part of your promoting tool. Take advantage of our low-priced promotion packages with commercials, interviews, giveaways, reviews, and much more. We have special offers when you mix and match and bundle your options. Contact us at 876-286-9216 or 439-5160. Styles FM for the most effective way to exploit your marketing dollar. Remember Styles FM on social media. View us on YouTube at Styles FM Radio. Follow us on Instagram at Styles FM. Like us on Twitter at Styles FM 961. Become a fan on Facebook. Styles FM 96.1. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, now offering stage, lighting, and trust systems for your small and medium-sized events. Whether it's a stage show, concert, drama play, wedding, street party, or club setting, you name it, we'll bring it to life. Call us at 871-5212 or 844-6531. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, a sponsor of In the Know of the Law with Sergeant Del Rose Green and also Real Talk with Lady Cleo and Daddy Rude. The views expressed on this program are not necessarily necessarily the views of Native Broadcasting Network or Styles FM. Welcome back to Real Talk. And of course, our text line, or WhatsApp line, which is 876-453-1444 is a buzz right now. And we see a friend there, 416. Hello, Styles family. Styles FM, good night. Just joining in. Good night to you too, my dear. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the show. And our issue that we were addressing, social issue that we were looking at, is the issue, well, the recent video that is, of course, viral by now, of a teacher with a verbal onslaught of a student at the Pembroke Hall High School. We're not certain of the, the, the verbal conversation of the student because we weren't able to hear all of that so clearly but we know that the child was also um in response mm -hmm. just cer certain things but the extreme to which the teacher spilled her guts we thought that nah, that was just really really way overboard all right and it's very unfortunate it's disgraceful it's unfortunate and we trust that help will be sought where it needs um, to be sought, and of course, help will be offered to all the relevant parties involved. All right. Um, so, so prestige. Uh, let's see quickly what the other messages are. So, what's Ron saying? Okay, we got Ron already. Yeah, I think we got Ron already. Rambo wants the video. All right. So, Cassidy, can I send you the video? And you send it off to them. All right. Um. Patricia says, good night, Lady Clear and Prestige. She's listening in from Ampton Court. All right, way cool. All right. Um, who else is up there? Who else is up there? We want to see. Who else is on the text line tonight? I'm going to try to find that video to send it off so persons can see it. So, um, all right. Cleo, the teacher is an adult and should be setting example for the youngsters of how to resolve a conflict. Yeah, right, right, right. Um, indeed, indeed. And I don't know. Never let the Generation X guys, teachers out there, let this be an example. Don't let Generation X pull you out remember it's called x because you don't know what it is it's unknown 
And we really don't really know for sure where these kids come from. Them brave and bold and brazen. Yeah, many of them fear no foe. They don't care. They do, they say anything. They don't give a rat's you know what about anybody. Not even their very parents in many instances. So we can't allow them to draw us and to pull us to any point where we sin our souls and sink ourselves, right? Because at the end of the day, nobody will say, oh, the child said this or the child said that because they're children. And let me just say, you see, and I'm going to probably say it unapologetically because I'm going to choose the words carefully. There are some people that are between the ages of 12 to 17, 18, which who are unfortunately just having the age alone, but they are not really children. I don't know what to call them or to refer to them as, but there are some, and I just use the word some, there are some persons between that age group where we think they are children or we have them as children because they fit in the description or the definition of a child. But I can tell you, there are many of them out there who are not children. They are something else in a child's body. Right? Whether it's the exposure during socialization with at home society, wherever, you know, whether it's the things they listen to, whether it's the food some of them eating, I don't know, but there are some of them who don't act like children. And when you hear the conversations that they are engaged in, when you hear all the talk to adults on the road, at school, at home, you wonder if I pick them here or what, right? And sad to say, some of the parents know, say, some of the people that they have at home who they're supposed to be children are not children. They're not the innocent children that some people have them to be, and it is sad. Because while it is that some of us fool ourselves, oh, this, this is a child. What's the definition? Is it only by age? You know? Many of them minds who we think are not developed or they're not mature enough because they're this and they're that. You'll be surprised to know the things that they do and engage in. And then some of us, oh, just have them all as putting them in one big basket as innocent kids. They are not all innocent at all. And that is just the harsh, cold reality. So while it is that some of us teach children, there are others who don't. And something needs to be put in place to deal with those social ills of those youngsters who are supposed to be children, but are something else, or they act like something else. Something needs to be put in place, whether from the parental aspect of it, society, um, government, these social issues need to be addressed, right? From the very grassroots of it all. They need help. Many of them need help, and they are going in some, some environments which just not helping them to be, be, behave like children. Sad to say, yeah? Sad. Uh, let's see what CD is saying here. We're going to be moving on from this <sighs> heart-wrenching issue. Cleo, some kids out there will kill you, me. Uh, yeah, true. Glad I don't have any to deal with. We used to get some big lick with some tough pot cover. Don't want to be anywhere near them. Them crazy. Yeah, sad. Hey man, some of them are hard and cold for true and colors. Next one, Cassidy, who else is up there? Um, hmm. Condolence. Uh, I am a teacher. Where do I start with this one? They only show the teacher part. What happened to the student? Good question. Students can be disruptive very much and ill-mannered. I know, right, sister? I think she just reached her boiling point. I'm a teacher, and a lot of the times I have to walk out of the classroom, and these children are seven, eight, and nine 
years old. <laughs> Oh, they are, their behavior is condoned most times by parents. And that's what I'm talking about. Socialization and parental responsibility. Many of them do not take responsibility for their children's actions nor for their actions. And teachers get the blame at the end of the day because yeah. they think when they send them to school, and we alone must get them ready to function effectively in society. It can't work with we alone. One teacher to 30 and 50 and 40 and pick me. It can't happen. It can't happen. We need all the stakeholders to play their part in getting these children, you know, ready for a 21st <laughs> century. A true man. <laughs> me, me hurt. But if it's true, me not lie. Me hurt. Because I yeah. know what yeah. is possible out there with some of these children. I know. Yes. Mm -hmm. All in the secondary schools. And because they know that, oh, you can't, you hardly can punish them. Your worst can't touch them. Yeah? So all of that, they just, they just feed on it. Mm. And they just, if it, anybody look at school, just lick them back. And I see a lot of the issues that children do, things that children do, even among children. They come and they, 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 you hear the fancy speeches. But nothing deep goes into the disciplinary aspect of it. But then... And I'm not condoning the teacher's behavior, don't get me wrong. But readily, this person must get that and that person must. And I'm saying sometimes we have to call a spade a spade and be, be fair. Deal with the teacher accordingly, yes. But they would have picked me accordingly too. What, is sec what do you mean secondary school? You say secondary school. High schools. Yeah. Yeah, those, some yeah. of these high school students, yeah. you, they, they can't use, co well, corporate punishment is forbidden. Mm -hmm. And but I'm you can saying, you can you can talk to them high school. Exactly, yeah. you can't talk Certain to them either. Level. So your hands are tied. Mm. Uh, in every angle you can mm. think of. They're bigger than you. So you know? dean enough discipline, they, they'll be rude yeah. to dean enough discipline. They won't yeah. beat dean of discipline. They won't beat teacher. Yeah. Just for a teacher who seems quiet and humble to say, um, stop doing that, Mr. So and So, stop doing that, and mm. uh, excuse from my class. Them they school. might want to attack that teacher. Yeah, them high school just for being here. calm and, and simple and easy going. You know? Who they respect you know? Who they respect? Yeah. You get me? Sad to say. Yeah. Sad. Nyla, hi Nyla, how are you, my love? Um, teachers are treated as if they are they have no feelings. They are robots and not humans. Yes, my dear. In many instances. We are left to feel the blunt of it all. Even when the kids are the ones who are wrong, teachers sometimes get the full blunt of it all. Mm -hmm. We really need some more teacher like that, Lord Jesus. At first, the phone shouldn't be in the class to take any video at all. Um, <laughs> who is this person? 308. Um, I can't say oh, good night. This is Bright Eye. Yeah. Right, I knew that must have been a bright eye comment, you know. That doesn't sound like a bright eye comment. <laughs> mm. Um, yes, um, to an extent, bright eye, there should have been no phone, yeah. but it doesn't excuse that the fact that the teacher went overboard. Okay, mm. we, have to, we have to be honest and fair now. All right, let's see what Sadie says. Um, she said something just now, N normally, great like that. They don't in high school and 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 mm -hmm. and primary school. They're not allowed to carry a phone in the classroom. Um, there are schools I know that are not, mm. they're not allowed to carry it. Mm -hmm. And there are schools who, if they do carry, mm -hmm. they're not allowed the usage of it. So they shouldn't be seeing it on the compound. Um, I guess there are some schools that might mm -hmm. give the okay to have it because of what, maybe not all the children, but for whatever reason, maybe. The you know, most of the discussion schools, with the parents. Most of the schools, stuff. them now are blacker? No. Locker? Yeah. That sounds like foreign. Is that not me ask? No, sir. I, I guess some probably some private so what they schools do with phone? or schools that so what they do with you know, got the money like bag. that might have lockers. But what, what they do with the school bag? So oh, what they do with the phone? On the, on the decks beside them or on the chair beside so them or on the back them, of the... So they have phone in them bag? In yeah, school. There, are, there are some who have the phones in their bags, yeah. but they're not supposed to have it. So the teacher sees it, she, based on the rules that were laid out, the teacher has, could have, have the right to confiscate it and call the parent in to, to, to come and collect it, whether by paying a fine, I don't know, whatever. But they, they're not, there are schools that are, they're not allowed to have it any at all. But, but you know, have school. But where, these where, children are unruly. But you know, they're school, going to bring it. You know, a school nowadays where your bag put down there. 
Are you sit no, at your desk? dear. During exam time, that's different, son. Eh? That's different, dear. During exam time, you have a place where the bags go. Yeah. Which they're totally telling us to carry any bags, but they they are children who still work with their textbook. Cause yeah. they want some. Some of them want to go cheat. So so they'll have the bag section over there to put on their bags and whatever they have, and only go to their seats with their timetables and maybe. Yeah. Pen, they, of course, them pen and pencil, whatever. Yeah. Yeah. And if they need ruler, they carry those carry those. So you know, I'm, 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 for regular school days. Yes, yes. We you lift up the desk and put your bag in there. Some schools might have that. Oh, you yes, there? You, you, still have, you watch too much foreign show. Eh? You watch too much <laughs> foreign <laughs> show. <laughs> People could ask, boy, princess, you are there? You way back in the time, way <laughs> Who was minister of <laughs> where or who? Mm. Who was minister of education when this law? Pass, no mm. flogging, mm. crazy, everything crash mm. from that law pass. <laughs> no, no, see, you can't get something, Sadie, man. You're going to find Sadie, students nowadays, Sadie, man. Oh, boy. Oh, yeah, man. I beat the party, teacher them kind of something. If you ever pass. see a clap on student all <laughs> no, our high school, judgment. Yeah. You I can't tell do you. That. Kevin says, when I was going to school, there is a teacher named Mr. Heslop. Heslop. Just the name, make, make, make your fret. Yeah. Which who was that, um, Kevin? I bet Kevin come from Portland. I, I'm wondering. I bet he come from Portland. Let's see who else is out there. A Portland he come from. There is a cost. Mr. S. Lop. If your phone's normally logged in the office, mm. there is a cost if you're caught with it. Yes, I figured mm. that because I know that there are schools that charge you if you're caught with the phone. But they, they, they steal away and bring it anyways and hide mm. and use it on the compound anyways. Mm. They don't care anyways. Prime, um, prestige, which era are you in? That mm-hmm. one was an I mm-hmm. want to know the same thing. Yeah. But locker. So uh, then, then, won't I complain about this student then? Use them phone and I take pictures and stuff like that. I want to know, say, the student them have access to getting phone in the, in the classroom. <laughs> so that shouldn't be a complaint. <laughs> it shouldn't be. So they provide lockers so they can put their stuff in the right. lockers. Right. But the lockers will not determine, we still won't. Verify that they put them in the lockers. They can put them in their pocket the same way. But for you come in a school with it in your pocket and then they pan vibrate and you do anything, you're going to get expelled or suspend from school. Because it's the the rules. The laws need to be so reinforced that children understand that laws were made and they need to follow them. Right. And when they don't follow them, guess what happened? The same parents come to school and call the media. Oh. And what? My daughter this and my son that and... They are yeah. the ones who help to promote the bad behavior among the students. This is Jamaica, our education system. Yeah. 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 So many things need to fix. Education so system upon a level. Fix. Yeah. Believe you me. Yeah. I'm oh, not saying you know, this is not a first world country, you know. Like if you are in the United States or Canada, you know, point blank you can carry your, 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 your cell phone or your bag in your classroom. Your bag in your locker. And you take out the book, which is the class where you're going now, right? And you take out the book where you're going to use and go to your class. <laughs> and your pen and your pencil Let's see what and go to your class. Is. And after that class finish, yes. you go back to your locker now because you know them have that session that you're going to go to. You live next. a foreign long time, yes. you know. Yeah. I don't like long. live the long time. They have school here in Jamaica like that, you know. They have school here. Yeah, I guess they might have a few private ones yes. who have those privileges, but nah, yes. the majority doesn't. Eh? Why the government? The majority don't. So why, why, why the government, right, cannot implement that in the school them here? That can't happen. Well, you see, they invest in certain things and not certain things. It can't happen. Yeah. Well, look what the voice says. Good evening. Me out of it because these kids' parents need parenting. <laughs> Muchly. <laughs> Uncle Prestige, mm-hmm. this is J.A. Lockers would be a dream free shop for them. Yeah. It would be a day. Lockers the whole time now got class. Lord, I don't know. How are you saying? How you mean? No, these, these generations, the generation is just X, capital X. All right. Um, well, people are still typing in, but as we go through, we see how much we can um, share, right? Hello. Children cut out Bible pages just to put their phones inside. We never know the one here. Mm. Deliver me, Jesus. Mm. Oh, my God. Flog, flogging and hanging need to need for forward. <laughs> All right, Sadie. I learned that children used to cut out their... Well, I, I've heard it before, but I, I heard it from a real reliable source. 
in recent times that they cut out the pockets and mm. leave school and gone on some mm. buses yeah in corporate area all yeah. about mm. and they gone wherever with whomever on buses that's an old sub man oh jesus I want you, what no, you don't ask me a while ago. Oh, you hear me God. Either. And then I have something I hold something. I mean, you know about doing something a long time. Oh. You know about doing something for 1945. Teacher, I forgot, got called, pick me. Yeah. Knock on bus <laughs> you door. Know? Knock on bus door and call, pick me out. I hold something that for 1945. Crazy. This one says, this girl yeah. have a tailor, tailor sword, a secret compartment in her bag, and teacher will never find it. You see where them put them, 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 them skills to? But give them something in a school for do one one coursework assignment for do and for carrying on at a certain time they can't manage it that is the problem but the the, the trick yeah. of how to yeah oh boy you know, mm. see, got you and you know beat the system yeah my granny tell me mm. say if the head of the stream dirty mm. the bottom can't clean mm. teachers just always get getting bashing get mm. always get bashing all if Parting a fight, you get in trouble. Yeah? For real. Or the teacher going to the fight mm. now, pick me all over stop mm. and say, okay, teacher mm. pathway. Fling on a big lip and teacher. So I like me you now, you know. Unless me really see where one I gonna really reach a place. Me not really I can promise you say, well, back then I used to say that. I don't know about now. <laughs> I might have to just jump in there now and try. You know? But I used to say, me not going into no fight unless I see where one child could really get some serious damage. Me not way because me not train for part of the fight. Referee train for part fight. And referee will know how oh, when the man a box and a box and a box at what point up top in and part it. Mm-hmm. I didn't get that training, sorry. Yeah. So don't expect me now to leave my class, stop teaching my class. They're already distracting my class and me now must stop teaching my class throughout the whole Pitting them, we are concentrated upon when me I try to teach them. So the school them nowadays, you know, are security upon the and school them? Eh? Security on the school. Some of the school security yeah. is to watch the gate and see who coming so in why, and who going out. So there the are school security officers that yeah. some schools are privileged to get one yeah. assigned to them. And so why they, they don't get that in every they school? Help with that. Because you know, never train for them kind of things, eh? Look and them have the security man. them there. Why? Here, look, look here, look here. What you mean? Me don't know which way to look. I agree with you, lady. Tell me which way to look. I mean, I look, me, me, I look right now at school now if with the security. If you were ever in our shoes and the sometime, you see, man, mm-hmm. and see what we endure. Yeah. Sh- I don't know normally, no. Me know that. Oh, okay. I heard of a case where a teacher plans to do something of based on the curriculum now with yeah. the students. And... The, the the parent the, 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 it had to do with outdoor activity and observation of how plants grow and things like that things that would get them mm. utilizing their hands and getting a little bit dirty but they would have been they would have taken clothes to change off yes and the parent or the person who they live with who pays rent mm-hmm. <laughs> the parent <laughs> comment was yeah I never said I picnic on my school. We get in and out dirt. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, who does that? If a teacher is going to take your child on the outside into the dirt, then it must be for a very, very good reason. Mm-hmm. Something that would enhance that child's learning mm-hmm. and education. Because the last time I checked, Education is not just being in the classroom yeah. and the teacher up there and you down there and you just mm. are right, right, right. Some it, yeah, some it, science entails, class. Where you have yes, to go man. All some, kind of practical activities, yeah, sometimes are, you know, experiments. Yeah. You know, so for a parent who is supposed to be well thinking and smart to say, when I send my picnic on my school for that, just says a whole lot. But then again, then mm. again. But we gotta, we gotta change our. So it's, our, it's our, like them saying them you go to school for, and I tell you what to teach them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. And they can't manage this homework and that homework when the curriculum guide has the very same homework oh. in there that the government stipulate that we should teach from. Oh. <laughs> Socializing goes a far away. These parents, true, 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 true. But we're gonna change our issue on this one. Thanks, guys, for your focus on. 
um, the issue with these young people and the teacher there. Nobody said anything about the students at Grove that ate the principal with a stone while she was stopping a fight. Can mm. you imagine? Mm. All in something they know. Same thing he was talking about. Devoir, what you want to say when they come show me for? Mm. Eh? Yeah. Why are we trying to justify our actions? Our society lack conflict resolution regardless of what led up to this event. No excuse for that behavior. We are not excusing it. Mm -mm. Wrong. We are not excusing it. Mm -mm. Excusing it. We are wrong, talking about wrong, wrong. all the facets. facets that would have contributed to this mm. and that not just one thing should be looked at but everything should be looked at i'm glad the minister said stick strict action will be taken next week well i don't have a problem with that because if she wrong she just wrong but i want for strict actions to be taken right against all persons within the school system who conduct certain kinds of behaviors that are unacceptable and there is no degree of acceptability hers was way unacceptable the child who would have created a, a, a scenario of being disruptive continuously and continually there should also be a similar the relevant um action strict mm -hmm. action taken to mm -hmm. and you're a child who it's a teacher. There should be that same strict action taken and not just when a teacher probably retaliates and slaps a child because they attack the, 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 um, the, the teacher, teacher first. Yeah. So that's my take on it, Ron. Yeah? And I think I'm being fair because I've always tried to be fair right across the board. Level playing field for everybody. What we say? A topic coming up next. Yeah, man. Let me tell you. Mm -hmm. Guess what, guys? It's now 10.30, though, so don't go anywhere, you know. The time is brought to us by VJ Printing Services. And Real Talk is sponsored by Native Audio Stage and Lighting. Architects, draftsmen, and surveyors, get your drawings printed in high-quality professional standards. We can satisfy your printing needs. Whether it is for presentation to your clients or for submitting building and subdivision application, make it VJ Printing Services. Whether drawing by hand or with computer-aided softwares, we will plot your negatives and print the copies as you need. We do high-quality white paper printing that is water-resistant and never fades, unlike traditional blueprint. For more information, call VJ Printing at 893 Antonio, Port Antonio. It's the Police Week celebration. Kicks off on Monday, November 25 with Open Day. Let's talk. Port Antonio Square comes alive. Come and see counterterrorism, narcotics, recruiting, and many more. At 6 p.m., special performance stage show by the police and partners. Friday, we run a boat at every police station. Everyone come link. And finally, Sunday, December 1st, church service at New Testament Assembly, 2A Allen Avenue. Come for a blessing. JCF, a force for good. Police into partnership. 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 For the best quality in sound reinforcement and backlining, native audio. We have professional engineers with over 20 years of experience. So call us and we'll take care of your parties, wedding receptions, barbecues, conferences, and small stage shows. Crystal clear sound, native audio. Our prices are the best. Call us at 871-5212. That's 871-5212. Native audio. We make your events audible. 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 <laughs> Your Saturdays will never be the same again. 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. on Styles FM. Get the showdown. Social commentary. Tune in. Tune in. Good morning, teacher. Love time. E. Edge, your love with love song. Oh, happening. Between 9 a.m. and 1 p.m. on the People Station, Styles FM, 96.1, 96.5, 96.7. Only the smooth sailing with Colin Anthony. Shotgun for the pain. Native 
audio stage and lighting. Now offering stage, lighting and trust systems for your small and medium sized events. Whether it's a stage show, concert, drama play, wedding, street party or club setting, you name it, we'll bring it to life. Call us at 871-5212 or 844-6531. Native audio stage and lighting, a sponsor of In the Know of the Law with Sergeant Adele Rose Green and also Real Talk with Lady Cleo and Daddy Rude. The views expressed on this program are not necessarily the views of Native Broadcasting Network or Styles FM. Welcome back to Real Talk, ladies and gentlemen. And we're going to go into our Vox Pop for tonight. I tell you, brothers and sisters, you got to tune in right now. Tell your friend, to tell your next friend, say, hey, Real Talk gets hot right now. Hotter right now. All right? So, our Vox Pop for tonight goes to men, to women, and collectively to partners together. So, are you ready? If you're ready, send me a text that you're ready because it gets hot. Men, if you became incapable of servicing your woman, <clears throat> what are your truth? Yeah. <laughs> Men, you're no longer able to service, to sexually gratify your woman. Would you allow her to get her intimate needs fulfilled elsewhere while she still tends to your household needs? Men. Making it simpler and easier for you. For y'all, yeah? <laughs> so you, you, you had, for example, it could be an accident. God forbid. <clears throat> but let us say you had a situation where your, your member is no longer able to function. Right? You are no longer able to rise to the occasion. And... You need assistance. Right, Cassidy? In the answer. <laughs> <laughs> you need help. You need help around the home. You, you still boy, want man. the clothes to get Cassidy washed. Young boy, so you you want the house that. to clean. <laughs> you want the food to be cooked. You need companionship. You need someone there for you. Mm. To be by your side during your very tumultuous time mm -hmm. right mm -hmm. so prestige mm -hmm. you cannot provide the phone phone lines are ringing off already yeah. <laughs> i mean i don't yet call a holy thought that the one you man cannot manage no more yeah. is it okay would you say you know what this woman has been there for me all the time and she love me mm. And I know she loves me and I love her too. Mm -hmm. So guess what? It's because I can't give her what she normally used to get. Mm -hmm. It's okay, my girl, to go find somebody else. No, it? sir. Hold on a man. Let me finish the statement. That's in my, my cabinet. It's okay, gentlemen. Are you saying it's okay? You'll allow her mm -hmm. to get that gratification out there. Fulfill those desires. And then come back because... What? You need attention. What? Call her on the 453. Lady Cleo online and, and, and Prestige. Welcome to the show, sir or ma'am. Good night. Good, Good night, night, sweetie. How are you? Fine. How old are you, honey? 20. 20. <laughs> the 20-year-old. That's not like a I kid. 20-year-old. Hi. What's your name? Vanessa. Vanessa. Yeah, talk up in on the phone, Vanessa. Go ahead, let me, let me can't hear you so clearly, Vanessa. Hello? All right, I don't know if this Vanessa. Vanessa. Vanessa, are you really 20? If not, you need Vanessa. to um, remember it's an adult show. You hear, Vanessa? All right. All right, so I, I'm extending the invitation to the adults to call in. And to tell us, the men in particular right now, it's your turn, men. We're starting off with you. And let me just share the rest of the Vox Pop so when we go to the second part, you'd have been privy to it prior, right? So women, your man works 
a limited salary and gets another woman pregnant. How do you suggest he shares this income? And should his baby mama have a say in how it is spent? Oh, me not hear you. No. Oh, me, me not hear you at no, this point, Prestige. No, no, me not ready for that part. Me know you wouldn't be. No. I know you wouldn't be, brother. Start from me tap, come okay, down. okay. Yeah. Okay. We're going to start from Cassidy. the top, come down. Part two, yes. you're quiet. Yeah. Is that okay? If you ever say yes, you can, can move on, you see? Because him, him has said for shake him head up, up and down yeah. like this. And a while ago with the woman, him head go sideways. No, no, no. Okay. So, women, your man works a limited salary. It's not a big salary. But you know how I manage, you know, because I feel him little and I feel him little make a little muckle. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right? But the man go out there and gets another woman pregnant. I would like to know, ladies, how do you suggest that this money we now get share for you plus the other new one now? And the question really is, should this woman have a say in how that little muckle is spent? So she's going to shorten your much for your baby. Uh-huh. Should she have a say? And the other part to the Vox Pop says, Partners, say you still have feelings for this person. So he went out there and got somebody pregnant. Right? You have feelings for the person still. You still have that connection, that oomph in your spirit for them, in your soul. Mm -hmm. Would you make up with your ex even though he... Even though she had multiple partners while you were apart, while you separated, mm -hmm. is it okay for if you bring her break off, yeah? yes, yes, and you go have our friend, mm -hmm. one ex friend on the road, mm -hmm. multiple partners you had that's not a while problem. you broke off with her, is that mm -hmm. okay? Yes, that's not a that's not a problem. Would you still make up? Mm. Would you yes. want her to, to, to make up with you if that happened? That's not a problem. Would you make up with her if it is that you learned that boy, she went to Cassidy mm -hmm. while you were apart. Yeah. She saw Cassidy for a while. Yeah. And she dated somebody else. Mm -hmm. Men have a problem with that. Oh, so you would yeah. still take her back? What's the she have nobody not done it? He so <laughs> said can't done. It can't done. <laughs> so we <laughs> are right with that part. <laughs> because we are human beings. You get me I say and we have to go there go, go but, explore life. Sometime and we go explore life and mm -hmm. we don't put a cap on it for tell a person say you can't deal with six men. You get me? I say we don't put a cap on it. So those you know days are long gone, you're saying? Yes, it because it used to be that way love, one time. The feelings may you still get. be there. Yes. You get me? I say, and oh. you ask a woman where no come out of your head, them in your head and then lock in your head. Can't but come because out. they move on. And they move on, and they move on, and they move on. You move and on, try to move now, on too. You move on too, and you realize now, say, it not work out for them. But Prestige, lacking at them heads, seeing you know, we are saying, the best man that me ever have in my life. Because mm -hmm. Prestige no care who they deal with, and they move can't on. Can't compare can't to. Can't compare to Prestige. And even though they shouldn't prestige. compare, but they, they, the reality can't is. Can't compare can't to Prestige. Compare. And they still Real end up back at Prestige. Real talk. For real. I saw it going to life. I love to hear from the men out there and, mm. and the women too, but of course. Mm. So men, we're mm. jumping to your yeah. part first. But we're part not gonna jump one. On, we're not going to touch the scene. We're yes. going to go back up first. Part one. And we trick along and come down. I want yeah. the men to tell me, mm. Donald, mm. I hope you reach home and mm. can manage to talk to me. Why are you trying to disturb Donald no man? <laughs> Donald, engage. <laughs> Right, right Donald, now. Donald is not right. engaged right now. Yeah. Donald is about to, to call in and tell us yeah. what is going on. We are bright eye can call in too. Lord Jesus. You get me? Bright eye, I know. And we have, about... um, he might listen. Bright eye. Yes, one, he texted. Bright eye, open your business and find out bright if you are in Tony Where is Dandan? Dan Dan. <laughs> Why yeah. is Dandan Dan so Dan quiet Dan tonight? Dan Javi in too. We're Javi in there. I wonder. Yeah. Men, I want to know if yeah. you are no longer able to service your female, your yeah. wife, your girlfriend. Are you going to sit there on your selfish bum and <laughs> not allow her <laughs> to feel any pleasures elsewhere? While if I did you, mm -hmm. you're going to road to Mary Jane and Sue. Mm -hmm. Okay. Call on the 453. Good night, caller. Welcome to Real Talk. Hello, good night, sir. Yeah. Oh, hi, the boy. How are you, sir? 
I am fine. How are you doing? I am good. You're, you're rather quiet tonight. I want to hear you dissect part one of our Vox Pop, sir. <laughs> mm hmm. And by the way, this was Lady Cleo's idea, the first part, especially. <laughs> <laughs> it does not sound like that rule, does it? I know, right? A lady clear part that. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Remind, remind me to say again. Because, so, if you became incapable of servicing your woman, mm. the member not standing up anymore, he's not functioning, would you allow her to go get gratification outside, elsewhere, and come back and still look after you? No, man. Too much toys. Still nowadays, see, she go do that too. Too much toys? Yeah, you can compare a toy. Hold on there. The boy. Can no, you no, compare no. a toy to no. the actual fingers of a man on a woman's body? No. Can you compare a toy to the warmth and the strength that she feels when a man holds her firmly? Can you compare a toy to what she goes through when she reaches cloud 20? How dare you mention a toy? No, no. You see, the thing is, you know, the more going like to the toy can take over from we. So, if in that case of me, you can't satisfy anymore and she wants to go a road, then go on a road and stay a road. That's selfishness? No, I'm not selfishness because if me can't satisfy, I wish I was stay for then. then she can't... wants to take care of you. She wants, no, no, she mean... loves you and she's looking out for you. No, well, if you want nurse to come take care of me, then. <laughs> <laughs> you know something? The boy, I can tell you this. I spoke to a dear friend of mine. Um, it was about a couple nights ago on the very issue. And believe it or not, your exact sentiments, your exact words. No, man. If she, she can't be with me no more, go on. Me pay one nurse to come look after me. I could not believe yes. why I said that. Mm -hmm. yeah, yes. You're not have no feeling. You're not have say say say. You never send your somebody. So tell me something now, the boy. Yeah. What is with the fact that the fact that she probably would have say. Well, let me jump a little bit to, to part three. The fact that a woman could have, say, multiple partners, and mm -hmm. you took her back because, boy, you've been out there and you said there's nothing compared, you know? And you really feel the energy of this woman. You can take her back then, despite knowing that she had other partners while you were separated, for example. Mm -hmm. What's the difference now with knowing that she's going there just for gratification because your member is dead? God forbid. <laughs> <laughs> and she goes there just for that. But her love, her devotion, can I say no, her dedication is to you? If she, love, if she did love me, she didn't want to go there. She da, she da, she da, um, she da call it now, turn, turn none to. So if you loved her, wouldn't you want her to not stay there and be burning? That's why my grandmother says if you love something and it not work, you let it go. It's just like peeling an orange, you know. After peel the orange, you can't put them back the skin. After you cut the orange and eat out everything out there, you can't put it back together. It doesn't make no sense. But, but, but what would you be losing when you really can't go back to that place anyway? Your, your member can't be firm enough to go back there, so let her enjoy it elsewhere. Yeah, let, let her enjoy it elsewhere, but don't come back where I... <laughs> I, oh boy, I hear you, sir. Yeah, man, just be a nurse to take care of me till me pass. Okay, and you won't have her up? No, exactly. Then, then, then she not go dead here. We may have her up. <laughs> but if she goes every night, go tonight and come back. Uh huh. And somebody exercise and football and everything go on. Me must go feel nice and comfortable. She come back in. Oh, honey, I, I enjoyed myself. But so what if you don't know about it, too? In a sense, where well, you say, would you allow her? You, you would have some knowledge of it. So you wouldn't be okay not at all with that? No, no. So let me ask you a spin, spin of the coin for a minute, because daddy would, would hate this part. But if it were a case where you are up and ready and gearing and this woman gives you no vibe at all, how come you men go out there to find other exciting women to give you combos? And then come back home to this woman and nothing wrong with her really you now because she don't really have the excitement. But you go out there and you do it and you come back and she must take on yeah. the back. How that works, darling? Yeah. Tell me now. It's near, near place, me going to my bathroom. Now. Me know. 
Me no. Prestige, say something, you're too quiet. But I not really utter road to really go for no no nowadays now that um the, the disease them so prevalent and it's so easy to boop boop as somebody touch you, you get something. Ah, when the so I'm going to the bathroom, I'm relax and then I go back to my bed, I'm good. Yeah. <laughs> I hear you, sir. I hear you. Yeah. Hmm. Before so, I'm gonna start myself enough. I'm start behaving myself enough. You start okay. So before yeah. you start behaving yourself, you'd have been okay with it. Just the same as what I'm asking. Would you have said what I'm not gonna de- 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 can't manage her, you know? She not give me vibes in a star. Eh? I'll ask you to make a call for help. Oh Jesus. The boy have a good night. <laughs> have a good night, the boy. <laughs> Take care of you, so Oh boy. Thank you, sir. <laughs> uh, <laughs> all right, boy, the boy, the boy, bad like yours. So first thing I want to hear from you. Let me explain something to you. Mm-hmm. Do you know what it is, right? <laughs> to have a nice young lady, right? Yes. And even... What? Oh, that thought. A call yeah. coming in on the 453. Good night, caller. Welcome to Real Talk. Good night, Clea. Good night, Prestige. Good night, ma'am. Me, me have little tops. We mm. had to little tops that were on the put out palm vice. But yes, Lord have mercy, upon poor we woman. Let me tell you something. Mm-hmm. Clear, mm-hmm. Traitor. When woman want man, them body flatter like fish. Oh, whoa. and let me tell you, it, when your body, me, let me tell you straight up. Me have a friend in Florida, I live in New York. When we are, when me want kiss, my tongue tell me can it get white. Yes, me want romance, my breast tell me because it start to feel funny and that. Uh, me some, you know. Yes. When my little Susie down here, so want to garden to the water, it flatter, it jump, boom, 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 mm-hmm. boom, 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 like something like a heartbeat. Right. Hey, hey, hey. Uh, hey. So, <laughs> Lord, I make nothing dead in my life, right? <laughs> so, so wanna learn to control that? You can't control that. Hold on there. Oh, hold on there. I'm not being control. Is that man talking about control? It, yeah, wanna can't control that. Look here, man. Listen, listen. You can't control it for three months, one year. But yeah. you see, when he, the, when the body get ready, mm-hmm. no control, no different that. Them no. What do you mean no control? Them, them, Sweetie. Oh, no, no, no. Them oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Nobody knows about con- lack of control like a man. So he how knows. We go, how we go in a bathroom, go do what we have to do as a javin say, um, right. say a while ago. I we go in a bathroom, do we think? In a mic. In my girl's talk, we always say, yes. man can't only go with sex without sex for three days and yeah. a woman go for three weeks. Yeah. Yes. Right? Yeah. So the man, in can go for long, the woman can go for long, but you see, when the female body ready for talk, a real talk. Put the man, ka, man a liar. Yeah. It talk, my one talk. Yes. Yeah. It talk and it chat and it trust me. It it have me all kind of weird and the head no feel right and all kind of sit like a bad. Yes. Mm. And you see any time the garden water. Yes. Everything normal. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so you're saying it's so, difficult for the woman to just stay there and not getting anything. That a suffocation. Oh, punishment. As that would have say stress. Any one of them are the same, same thing. Punishment and suffocation. Yes. When, when, Lord have mercy. If me did, Lord, no make nothing dead for me, no, as me say already. Una, if you learn to control no yourself, like how you learn to control yourself. Learn to control no yourself, like how you learn to control, control yourself. Like control what? <laughs> what you mean? What is he talking about? What is he talking about? All right. He said, rubber there. Yes, look, the rubber are for pleasure. Oh, you see, when you reach the peak of the oh, net, rubber can't help you. The rubber rub you up and you feel good. Oh, yeah, blah, blah. But it, it, there's something inside that you have to water down. Yes. It has to water down. Yes. Only if you learn to control yourself like how we learn to control you know, ourselves. You know, my darling, it's, it's funny. He might say, I'm going to the bathroom. I'm going to the bathroom and when he come out, he feel good. But you say, man, drop asleep and wake up. Yeah. As a, yes. Boy, turn up. Yes, turn up. man. No, sir. No, no, eh, 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 we're good. We're good. We're good. Prestige bias to true. Yeah. And, the, and, and, and the women, there are a lot of women who, who know if you do, if you satisfy yourself, I know all right. That is not 
going to help all the time. That's what no, she's saying. It's not. We no, I didn't say it. All right, you know, I say you quit on the work maybe for eight hours. Uh, if you do it tonight and drop a sleeper man, you wake up worse than before you mean start doing it. Mm -hmm. Then say so experience need a wisdom. I mean, I use nobody experience. Honestly, me, I use someone hey. tonight. That yes. Answer. Yes. That means say, hear, that me use real talk. That, that means a man always man. go for 50, but you see when the garden yeah. water. <laughs> talk the things, them, honey. Different thinking when the garden water. Different thinking. Real talk. No, no, talk again till when it well overdue. May I use the word well overdue? Yes. Overdue. Right. Because sometimes you can't blush it when. Right? So yes, that's true. And it and, and it listen, but hello, we always say yeah, eat salt and of a course, so maybe then take out the iodine out of sand and nobody don't feel nothing. <laughs> <laughs> am I am I am I know about no. but, but what it come like say it come you like hear say, a man telling us that? Oh like my so, goodness. It come like so we always have to get born. I'm gonna soak my salt fish with tonight to fry tomorrow. So me constantly I eat that make practice get then to a piece of salt fish. Every time your company is weird you have to buy salt fish. Where are you calling from? <laughs> <laughs> British Columbia. All right. Oh, Let me my tell goodness. You really, you get your company's radio. You're going to tell you about salfish. <laughs> <laughs> you're going to soak. Oh, After boy. you eat? Listen. That's how your body not eats all the time. <laughs> <laughs> me eat too much salt, man. <laughs> oh, Lord. Noblet. <laughs> Thank you, Nob. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Take care, my darling. <laughs> All right. Oh my goodness. Uh, I just I, I just love her <laughs> her, her explanation of it all. Well done. Well yeah. done, Nov. Well done. We have a caller yeah. on the nine five four. This is, looks like Dan Dan. Good night, caller. Welcome back. Well, I'm for me, a little bit. Yes, I know yeah, you I would, know. right? I know you would. <laughs> Come on. No, no. I believe what what she's talking about. Yes, no, but you know, she's true. I, I, I believe I shut up. Me meet, me meet, me meet, me meet girls like that, man. Yeah. That's why we always are gonna get born as a man. <laughs> we are always get born. Can the body always eating? Nothing wrong with that. <laughs> yeah. Wrong with that. <laughs> and that's how you go. <laughs> so when they hear them go and like say they're innocent, they, they are not. Can we always get born? Uh, but 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 Dan Dan. <laughs> yeah. I, I want your honest. <laughs> yes. Honest view on the issue that I just mentioned about the men. Yes, you you, you cannot show. you cannot supply that need, especially when the garden needs the watering properly. You can't fulfill that need. You know, if he said, okay, for you for a lower to get that sorting out and everything is as good and normal again. You don't think so? All you right. know, fear. All right. All right. You just know. You just mm -hmm. know. Me not allow. Me not, me not, me not, me, me not have them. I don't <laughs> do what them want to do. Them for do what them want to do. If they want to do it now, yes. while, it's, while it's working, fine. If they want to do it after, fine. Up to them. Just don't, I, I just don't need to know. Okay. And if you know you're not okay with it. I don't, no, no. All right. You see, you, you see if me know, if she, if, if she come to me now, well. That sounds like, a, like a some adding some insult to injury business or some revenge thing. Or some, but but what's the difference, though? What's the difference? Yeah. You are there with this woman. You don't, find yeah. her, you don't find where she's inviting you to use any toys. She doesn't bring up the subject any at all. She goes through day by day. You have a great um, relationship in terms of communication. You guys have fun together. You play. You go out together. Whatever the case is, you have dinners. You, she takes care of you and the house and everything is okay. But that subject never comes up. You're going to tell me, say, you don't suspect, say, Chances are this one is being she's very happy. And when the women get uh, what but, they need, they're but, very, but, very but, happy. But my suspicions, if I were to have one, would not be here or there. Because I, I you know, that wouldn't concern me. And you're telling me that you just be a normal well, not normal. You'd be an abnormal thinking man to say whether or not she is being serviced 
It really doesn't matter to me Look seriously here. because I don't know. I wouldn't I, I wouldn't bring up the I wouldn't bring up the subject at all. I um Look here, man. We're not, we're, 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 we are in, when, when we own a relationship, you know. Yes. That that that, that means that the, the person in the relationship is in a bond between your relationship. Okay. It don't mean that because by the all right, by the same token, me 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 not go me not go and tell her what me do. I will, will go with. Oh. I, I wouldn't do that. So there's deception it. there then on your part as well. So it's okay for her oh, to do the same. No. It's not a matter of deception. It's about that. It's just not disclosing. You don't have to disclose everything. Oh. No. I think there are women out there who would say they want to meet you. Oh, well, keep on listening because we have another other right. two parts to share. Cool. All right. Thanks, Dan Dan. All right. Let's 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 see. Dan has a different view from everybody, you know. Seriously. Dan is saying, look, really and truly, um, still, you're not dear to me. I won't ask the question. If I even sus- if I even think that she not bring up the topic, I won't bring it up either. So she do what she do, and mm. we move right along. Mm. Yeah. What a perspective, right? Yeah. Hardware says, prestige, bias. Thank you, hardware. Yeah. We're lumber. <laughs> We're lumber day. Anyway, Keisha says, real talk, lady Cleo. Ron says, Cleo, the vows were sickness and in health. And this is sickness. She better wait till me dead. Oh, yo. No. That's a whole different spin on this thing. You know? Let me see what, Ron, what else Ron is saying. Because how is it that you think it's okay? There are some women who probably would sit down and say, boy, God, mm. we can't take this, you know. Mm. We can't take this no more because this man I can't service me. I miss it till sickness and in and in um till sickness in sickness and in um till death do us part and in health. Now the man's sick and I forgot sit down with him. Me I punish, me I burn. What should she wish for him to go? But but can you imagine? Have a caller. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, caller. Good night. <laughs> uh, oh, hold that thought, Donald. Hey, bless any evening. Call, call us right back, Donald. It's twelve o'clock. It's eleven o'clock. <laughs> yeah, man, man. <laughs> All right. <laughs> it's now eleven o one. The time is brought to us by VJ Printing Services, and Real Talk is sponsored by Native Audio Stage and Lighting. A lot of interesting stuff when we get back. Architects, draftsmen, and surveyors, get your drawings printed in high-quality professional standards. We can satisfy your printing needs. Whether it is for presentation to your clients or for submitting building and subdivision application, make it VJ Printing Services. Whether drawing by hand or with computer-aided softwares, we will plot your negatives and print the copies as you need. We do high-quality white paper printing that is water-resistant and never fades, unlike traditional blueprint. For more information, call VJ Printing at 893-2266. Are you sick of living an average life and tired of just getting by? Do you want to take your life to the next level? Learn the secrets of the super successful. Listen to Power in a Half Hour with Coach Mark this and every Wednesday night on Styles FM from 9 to 10 p.m. Learn the habits of the super successful and how to make these habits work for you. Learn to turn your dreams and desires into reality. You can win in the game of life. Let Coach Mark show you how every Wednesday night on Styles FM from 9 to 10 p.m. Did you know that dengue, chikungunya, and Zika are transmitted by mosquitoes? This is why it is so important to get rid of tires, bottles, and other containers with stagnant water and keep barrels covered. Eliminating stagnant water is everyone's responsibility. Protect yourself and your family. A message from the USAID, PSI Caribbean, CARFA, and the Ministry of Health and Wellness. Do you have or are you seeking a place to rent, seeking employment or have a job vacancy? Are you selling a car or having a garage sale? Then come see us. Let Styles do the advertising for you and you'll be on your way in no time. Contact us at 876-286-9216 or 439-5160. Advertising Style. Advertise with Styles. 
Native Audio Stage and Lighting, now offering stage, lighting and trust systems for your small and medium-sized events, whether it's a stage show, concert, drama play, wedding, street party or club setting, you name it, we'll bring it to life. Call us at 871-5212 or 844-6531. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, a sponsor of In the Know of the Law with Sergeant Del Rose Green and also Real Talk with Lady Cleo and Daddy Rude. The views expressed on this program are not necessarily the views of Native Broadcasting Network or Styles of Fit. <laughs> Welcome back to Real Talk. <laughs> Off air is sometimes on we're unable to share. <laughs> Welcome back to Real Talk. I anticipate Donald's response tonight. Let's go back to the Vox Pop quickly to share what it is that we're talking about in case you're just joining us. I can tell you. Part one says, men, if you became incapable of servicing your woman, would you allow her to get her intimate needs fulfilled elsewhere, Father Jacko, while she still tends to your household needs? <laughs> I deliberately got this one together to, to, to get you men to just go ballistic on me. Um, good night, Donald. Yes, sir. Oh, I tell you something here. Yeah. Uh-huh. I listen to the gentleman. Know him name? Dan Dan. The other overseas one named Perfect in a man. Mm -hmm. Every girl ever love him. <laughs> I think so too. <laughs> Just like, uh, he no one uh, know. He no ask no question. Mm -hmm. He just uh, live. I, I, I want to tell you something. I made a real I want to ask him. I for the bills up here by shit. <laughs> <laughs> I guess once his needs are being met, uh, yeah, him all right, yeah. I guess. She'll take up half of everything, man. Half of the world has to be own, you know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But press cage. Ah. Uh -huh. uh, you may have focus on tonight, sir. Uh -huh. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, sir, boy. But you know, you know my condition. I have a condition. Mm. Um, and my condition leads up to the ineffectiveness of that tool, you know? Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm, right. You know, I say young old man, young girls, like old man, kind of get hot. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So, in you know my situation now, my boss, yeah. I wonder how I really play a situation like that, you know? Well, no, listen, no, the, get in us, well, 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 listen, the, the thing about it. Where is the Donald? I know born get? Yeah, man, I know born <laughs> get. The thing about it, in yeah, your situation, man. in your situation. I'm not used to the born situation already. Okay, no problem. But the part of it where I don't want you, man. Yes. yes. Nobody go out there and get the born and come back. Yeah. Come say to me, say, boy, mm. because you can't manage. Because there's a store down in Portland Town that sells everything. Yes. Yes. Yeah, man. All of the little ties but that we need. But Donald, and all of that Donald, stuff. my dear, do you compare the toys to your real tool when it was functioning like that? There's no comparison. You're not functioning no more, so you have to compare it, though. <laughs> no, you not, might not be going through that, but what if this lady wants the warmth? She wants the real life blanket? Mm. No. She's not good in your hips. She must be good somewhere else. <laughs> <laughs> but so you use the toys. You use the toys to do all the other things. And, and then you, you and then you have the warmness the next. Warm. So isn't it selfish though to be confining her to just toys? What is selfish about that? That yeah, girl. If she if you if you're a fear man and she wants to make sure that you are fear, yeah, you nice and you good. She's already doing that by being there for you. Being there for me in with in with, because hey yo, me no want no one to wash and cook and clean. Me, <laughs> Washing machine, better for wash clothes. But she's yeah. being a companion yeah. to you. You can have a conversation. You can sit and watch the news together. Watch yeah, TV together. Go out together. All of that. But when the when the the cooking part, the bedroom cooking part, and the cooking at the bedroom. Yes. Done, me, now why you come tell me about you go to the road, go make calm, get you nice and, and rose, and then you come back and tell us that I'm not another stuff. Mm -hmm. But you yeah, can't go back there anyway, so what are you worried about? What do you mean? Do man come back home, lay him up? All I have to say is once <laughs> you go to the road, let's go to the road. Yeah. 
Oh. Yeah. Yeah. She go out of road, yeah, come, out road and come in back, lay him up. Yeah, man. Yes, yo, you go out of road, yes, yo, out of road. Tired for you when you come in back and all that kind of something there. All about on our belly. Donald. And then now for the second part of your thing. Hey, hey. You could have left me. Go deal with one better, man. You understand? Yes. You know, they found my mind in no way, shape, or form when you left in a man. Mm-hmm. You stay with your better, man. Yeah. You don't have no comeback and comeback as a this or that. You don't eat funny vomit in a man. But what about a case, Donald, where you separated for circumstances beyond both of your control? It wasn't any messy. Separation, it's just that things happen with boy probably you got foreign and run off America. Me run off America and you that Jamaica. Mm-hmm. Yeah, me run off America. I'ma need my green card. So me run your truck up for wife and you that Jamaica. Yeah, yeah. Enjoy yourself. Mm-hmm. Your time. So be a, like how you up there, you can't come down till certain time till you get the green card and all of them things. So yeah. I'm go uh, enjoy myself. I'm gonna call a relationship guy. Yeah. Done. But there are some people who don't call it done and they want it back. Well, on, man. You tell me, so when me get the green card now, me must come back down. And say, me gone to seven years, eight years, ten years. Mm-hmm. Me must come back down. Then suppose me come back down, come see you with all one little young one, too. That's so, different, so, man. The young one, not another one, you know. We talk about the fact that she had different partners or he had different... In the case of a man, he would have had different... We are talking about she. Yeah. She have a different partner. <laughs> me no want to talk about... Why not? Me no, yeah. She going to make life yeah. better for the yeah. two of no. Life better now for the two of no. So tell me something. Oh, it's okay for you men think, say... You can leave the woman down here and oh, make a look better than for foreign. When you go foreign the same way, get married, have a picnic, picnic them up the air, and then come back expecting her to still be sticking around waiting on Unos. You know what time I'm going to tell her that my dear woman has said? I'm going to get it. I'm going to tell her that she's going to say that. You should call me here, bud. Huh? Mm-hmm. And you should stay with me. But Jesus, <laughs> okay, sir. I got it. I go to the big and get back new enough mm. and good enough. Mm. Yeah, but still remember the whole bumpy dirty road and you drive back. You still can't be the driver that would charge and drive and send someone. Yeah, but you have to look at it. I'm not that. So, you know what I know, man, where the next guy got play up with. And I come back and tell me that she was the best thing for me. Mm-hmm. So let's get back together. Now mm-hmm. we can be good friends. Hi, hello, how you doing? So you're going to move on with somebody else? You're going to move on with somebody else? Yes, man, we move on a long time. So oh, you, don't know, you don't know who I will play up in that way you're going to move on exactly. with? Exactly. That's what the first time you're going to play up in that. Eh? And you know that the play up is about you and not about she. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. You men are crazy. The play up is not about you, so <laughs> you never did play up the night before. I brought no play up for you. I you know how you to roll in a way. Come on, have that man. This is a brand new, is a brand new play, play pen for you. Yeah, man, I brought new playground for me, man. So, oh, when me start by the playground, you know, it is my yeah. playground. It's yours. Yeah. Okay, okay sir. Your territory now. Yeah. Yeah. So, so I want to ask you this, Donald. You're not making much money, and you yeah, end up getting don't another care. woman pregnant. Mm-hmm. How do you suggest, well, this is for the woman. Would it be okay if she determined the first one di- dictates how you share that money, if at all? Let's hear me now. You have multiple baby mothers. Mm-hmm. Let me take care of all of my them. Some of them now, they never get the full care yet, and some of them... Yes, them did get it and blah, blah, blah. But try my best to do that, see? Mm-hmm. Yes, the woman who me live with, 
She can't determine how many take care of my business, madam. Because mm -hmm. I'm my business, them, and me determine that. Yeah. Now, if she's a very good woman, what she will do, yeah. she will say, okay, you yeah, bring home $30. So, Tom, forget 15 Yeah, Tom, so she get 15 So, 15 left. And the next 15 I will split up between Mary Jane and if I multiple, the next 15 split up between them. Because all of the people they have to eat down for the $30. If she's a good woman, you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. But I me determine how all of my youth them live, ma'am. And I'll leave it up to a woman to determine that. So what right, you don't think it's unfair for you to know not be making much money and one of y'all is just barely going through and surviving and then you're going to split the same money in a three, four, five or six? Eh? You don't think that's unfair to the first one? Why you want to call it unfair? How is it fair? All right. You go to the street and you, and you make a one bat and the bat. You lick a six, then. Mm. And everybody jump up and shout, Whoa, it's nice. And you get a six. You understand what I'm saying? Mm. Now you have that child coming into this world. What you should I do? Abandon that child because the woman at home has at home, at home, said, basically, I should No. Go and get more money for that child. What you have to do is you have to try to make sure it's all of the money split between the two children. <laughs> you have to make sure it's all of the money split between them. So even if moms and two of us grew up and face enough, the one out of the street has to eat so. You understand what I'm saying? Mm. And she has to accept that. And you don't think it's fair for the first one, the wifey, to dictate and to have some say in how the money is supposed to be shared? I see the work it. <laughs> oh boy, I hear you, Donald. I hear you. You have to take care of all of the partners. Well, that's true. Kids, kids need need their fair share, yeah. Yes, man. So you can't make the woman at home. Yeah, you have some woman and I was serious tonight. You put it down. You knock out that is, you know. Yeah. 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 You have some. You have some woman where we say all right. I hear you. Am I ready? Yeah. I could just make sure that everybody comes to table. Yes. You have good women like that. And then you have some women in there. Everything I feed them in there, man. Mm hmm Them not bounce, them not change, them not turn. Them, hey, man, to run left them type of woman there. There was them woman there, man. Who so, you know, want it all for themselves and their children alone, right? Yeah. You understand? You, you can't do that woman where she's have a selfish enough. We know that so you have a child out there. Yeah. And I don't go be alone to be comfortable. No. You want a woman who can break your stuff. All right, you didn't go out there to cheat you now. You didn't go out there to do what you do. And you didn't go out there to get yourself mixed up and all of that. But the child is not to be blamed for that. But would you prefer if she had walked away and left you alone? And moved on? Like me say now, me tell you this, you know, me will give bun. And I tell you, if you give me bun, I'm going to tell you that me can't manage the fact that you give me a bone, you know. So me have a left. So if she so can't manage it, she can't leave. Fact, if you can't manage the fact that me give a bone and you still want to stay, then I just do that, man. Okay. That's all. I hear you, sir. Real talk. <laughs> yeah, man. Real talk, man. Big up yourself, Preston. All time, right, Donald. Donald thanks yeah. so much. Stay sweet as you I will yeah, try, my I, love. Say hi to the young lady for me. <laughs> <laughs> Keeping it real as usual, you heard from Donald there. Oh my goodness, always a pleasure hearing from my friend Donald. Big ups to all our friends on the Facebook Live. Cassidy, who we have on the Facebook Live, locked in tonight. Um, a lot of people, it seems. Mm. I can't see them from there, so my eyes them nearsighted ish. Mm. But let's see what the WhatsApp connection is saying for a minute there. Um, Stas is done in St. Thomas. Ooh, listening via tuning radio. All right, keep it locked. Keep it locked. Um, let's see who we have on FB Live. Can we see that coming up? All right, so in the meantime, though, we repeat our Vox Pop for you. Of course, we want to know from the men. Your member not working. There's something not rising to the occasion anymore. Give the woman the chance to go get intimacy out of road or what? Yeah? She's still there for you. She's still a whole things 
all the fort. You know, house are clean, your clothes nice and well ironed. Prestige does not look convinced, ladies. Your clothes well ironed and all these things. You get good feeding. You're able to even use your face if you have to. Yeah? But when she wants the real thing, she gets that elsewhere. Why would you be upset? I can't get it. Hello, caller on the 954. Sorry, on the 453. Good night, caller. Welcome. Hey, call it back. It, it clear prestige. Yes, sir. What kind of unbalance box for that we have today? Mm. Oh. Yeah, man, it's an unbalance to me. Because you know, as a woman, a lot of old. Yes. Only 20 years of shelf life. Women have what? 20 years of shelf life. And men have how many? A woman, a man have, a man have like 30 or far, up to 40. And you're telling me say a woman have 30 years of shelf life. You know, 20, easy. 20, 20. 20. But you're out of order. I'm listening to you because me past 20 and my shelf life is really up there. No, no, no. She, when she had 20, her shelf life is a 20 year, her sex, strong sex urge and whatever. The woman started at 16. Eh? Hey. All right. You had 16 for 20 years, past 16. Guess how much you get? 36. Hey. 36. All right. Put. Put, put four more years by 36 women and 40. You know, the most enough women with 40, 45 gone and menopause. Yeah. Not a lot of women. I don't think that's a lot of women. Yes, enough. A lot of women. Well, my experience is that most women, 45. Mm. You see, if they are, most women with 40, it's risky if you have children after 40. It's mm. risky, don't it? Mm-hmm. That's what it said for the majority, maybe, but there are okay. there are a lot of exceptions who have children that age and old, and they're fine. Right, so sixteen and uh, so so sixteen to forty. How much years they make that? So when they say when they reach the menopause uh, stage, uh, uh, eh? when they reach the menopause stage, they're not no urge. They're not no urge. Most no, most women. 59, no urge. I say, go to you. I'm going to skip. I'm going to tell you about 50 now. I'm going to knock women. Yeah. Uh-huh. 40, 40 after 40. Mm-hmm. Then I have the urge. You tell them I have to skip time and build up their urge. Oh, yeah. I beg your pardon. Oh, yes, so when you take it out, when you yeah. start at 62 young, so adult age are 18. Yeah. And let's say they, 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 when I'm starting to feel to really can start to angle sex. And when them after 18, yeah. 16 really, them just, them just are chatting and will really develop. Eh? And if they start too early, then them stop quick. If you tell them it's 36, them, they shut up. Mm-hmm. They have more than 20 years, I said that. That's the statistic. And, yeah. and when they reach 50, then most of them not have no urge. How we are say? Most of them, no, they, 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 I'll do the research on that one and let you know. Please do the research. I will check it. Because I know that there are women, it is said that women peak in their 40s. Peak, peak enough women. Yeah. Some most, that if they're they peak in their 40s, they start late. Yeah. But, them have to start, like say, when they're 20, yeah. 20 up, 20 yeah. and 25 up. Then they're peaking and they're 40. But if they start early, you know, some most women a bit and they reach 30, they might get on grandparents. No? Eh. Not most. But not most. It's trending otherwise, but it's not most. So, check the statistics. Right? You know, 20, 20 women, if they start early, Peter and they have a 50, start 15 or 16, they have a 15 year old where I always tell them father and come that time. They yeah, come have a pity early, so they turn grand. I know, I know several, I know several people at 30, 31, 32 are grandparents. Mm-hmm. Are women. So tell us, if you cannot um, service your lady anymore, I want to know if it's okay in your book for her to get that help somewhere because you can't manage. And I'm saying it depends on what you as a woman next. Not about no age, nothing. Despite whatever age she is, the point is you not have nothing to no, function no more. You no, not have nothing to no. function, man. 
that we are talking about, man. Whether she are 30, whether she are 50, there are exceptions, you know. And you have 50 year old who peak and high like a war, ready to go. And you have 20 year, 30 year old who can't bother. So that's not the point. The point is. Thank you for that. I'm glad you realize. But let's say you can function and well, you, and because you can go vice versa, the woman can do do um operation or whatever and can function too. Well, we not talk about that no man. We are talking about you and our function, what you are gonna do. I'm not telling you now, clear. Mm -hmm. She should be there for you. She is there for you, sir. She not gone nowhere. She not gone nowhere. Well, I shall do. Well, mm -hmm. she, it all depends on what she thinks. If she, because if you're dead and strong, she will she still feel she's going to do it. Only she's going to do it. She's going to test them. Say, you mean that pork you want to eat beef? You want that Yes, beef. Lord want, Jesus. So. Yes. Needless to no, say, no, if no, you're tan good, she's going to still go if she won't go. No, but may I tell about the fact that you're not tan good? Well, you need. No, well, you don't no, stand good, no mean to say you can't function, you know. Lord Ten Jesus. good. You mean not to say, well, if she's dear for you and take care of you, just like if you pay a nurse to take care of you. Yeah. So that's so that part. Yeah. If she'll take care of you, and she won't go, they go fix herself. She can't go and go do that. Because... Someone want to know if you're okay. You're that okay you. with it. That's what I don't know. That's what I don't know. I don't see her. I leave, but you know. Her. The point is, you know. Would you allow her? You, you, would you, you should suggest things a boy she wants this in a boy behaves me and tell the truth and me say I really need some and she had talked about it and she had hinted at it and she had give ideas you okay with it I don't know, I don't know because I don't know the woman when she will tell you there's something they will want it want it like that and I'll, 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 I'll come to you and tell you like that and I'll go take it I think her mother did and, and you know about <laughs> So, me don't know which woman I'll do that. Yeah, in the real world, yeah. Right here now, he might step on the floor and say, yeah. If he tell you, say, no, I don't really care about you, if he tell you. Mm. So, right? let me mm. say then. And if a man tell you, man, you know, you know really so, care so, neither. So, so, if, so, so if, she go, if she go out there and she go do it out there, I don't, I don't tell you and you'll find out. That's simply means saying she don't care about you. Well, well, as long as she not take her away the other domestic part and the other, other caring. Yeah. It, 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 not really, it not really matter, you know, she has satisfied herself because she, 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 she with you for the asset where you have. Yeah. And the money. Yeah. So the, the sex part, you, you can do it and that, that a fear all the way when you are a man or a woman at times. Mm. There comes a time when, the man, when you are married to him or whatever. You got to take up that responsibility when, when, when one can function. Mm. So you never work with me. You know, it, should, it shouldn't really matter, yo. It, 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 it matter shouldn't me. matter. So for you, it doesn't really matter if she go out there, go do it or not. It doesn't really matter. It doesn't really matter. Like, it's true in my face. It do deprive me of nothing else. Because oh. You can't stop that if you want to. And that me know to your brother. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter to me. You can't stop that. What it doesn't matter to me. It doesn't yeah. matter to me. That real talk, sir. Quicker. Real talk. So tell me something. Me have quicker. Tell me something now. It you have this girl and on a break off for yeah. a while, and she had multiple partners in between you and you know while you were apart. But yeah. some chemistry bringing her back together. Does it matter how many partners she had? It don't really matter because I had I have where had the magnet between the magnet and the steel between. Hey, hey. Really bring bring it back because. Definitely, there's something special about it. Yes. When you can you have a partner or two, I saw something more special when you never enjoy, she no enjoy. We bring you back together. And that so, thing can't finish, don't it? It can't finish. finish. You yeah, that's how I'm dying in love. You got to be so that, that connect me. You don't know that they in the world again, neither. So you're not thinking about who the god dear and who never god dear and because that thing can't finish, don't it? You know, makes, you know, makes sense. You know, there's a point of meat, by the way. My distance is about before. <laughs> I'm going to take you up and you don't even know that. You, know. <laughs> you, you have to face what a reality, a reality, you know. Yes. You just have to just drive on the highway where, where you go and you smile with the highway. That's right. So, so I so you just so you see junction and turn in highway, you know, you just go and drive and just take life easy and if you're afraid to have anything there. You get dead quicker. I, I lose all your skin. And that may know too. Yeah, and so 
Bila puyeza ya panguani, leza ya nsuwa kia anguani, piwe sana iti, anybody has a worry about them part of life. But I'm a woman, I go to throw up. All right, sir, thanks for calling. Cleo, Cleo, let <laughs> me tell you something, man. That not in my regime. I, I like his view though. Yes. I like his view yeah. because he does not worry about it. Yeah. Whether or not his member yeah. did that work no, 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 and she no, won't no. go. In point taken, she can go. If my member is not working, right? And you go out there, you choose to go out there, you go do what you want to do. You go on. And if you don't know about it? Me say, if me don't know about it, me don't know about it. Would you question it? No if you don't see she's not doing, she's not showing any interest in any toys. But she not Would you question? She's not showing any interest. Because my member can't do nothing, so she's not showing any interest. In other way, but, but it seems like I'm going to know. But, but would you suspect that she must be doing something or will you leave it alone? If she had do it out there and I don't know, where I don't see. Where I don't see art no leap. I don't see art no leap. So I'm not busy about that. But it me know and she tell me, say, she had go out there. Go do it. And she have to go, go do it and she got to go do it. Go on. Well, no, inconsiderate though. In. Give, just go on. Get, give me the time signal. Well, you no, get inconsiderate me Just go so. on. No, just go on. Because you know one thing with me? That you kill me half quicker. So <laughs> poor me here, my friend, they might tell me about Tony. And, and, and ask some girl that tell me about this guy named Tony. And Tony, you know what I mean? <laughs> you know see it? You know? And they might talk about Tony and Tony and Sharon there and Sharon can't hardly walk a weekend time because <laughs> of where we're Tony member and all them kind of something there. And at the same time, now me hear say, I see and Tony are link up. And then they could be, I'm not going to feel good. Can't manage it. I'm not going to feel good in myself. <laughs> so she just go on. Go on to Tony. Go on. And leave you alone. Go on. Make your mind and be at rest. Go. I will just work out what make can work out with the nurse. If the nurse get double pay, me pay the nurse double pay. If it help you out. To help me out. <laughs> yeah. You know what, guy? What time is it, Prestige? <laughs> time signal, please. Oh, the time is now um, 11.31. <laughs> time brought to you by VJ Printing, located at 4 Burnbrook Avenue, right here in Portland, Tony, Portland. We'll be right back. Architects, draftsmen, and surveyors, get your drawings printed in high-quality professional standards. We can satisfy your printing needs. Whether it is for presentation to your clients or for submitting building and subdivision application, make it VJ Printing Services. Whether drawing by hand or with computer-aided softwares, we will plot your negatives and print the copies as you need. We do high-quality white paper printing that is water-resistant and never fades, unlike traditional blueprint. For more information, call VJ Printing at 8 a royal date to everyone. It's showing you with the voice of DJ Prince, your royalty of music selection, represented for my show, your show, E-Tour, every Saturday night from 8 p.m. to 12 midnight with mixed moves and attitudes. And ladies, don't forget the special D-Tour hour from 11 to 12 midnight. Styles FM, the world listens. You just gotta tune in. Mm-hmm. Business operators, local and overseas, this announcement is for you. Styles FM is an internationally known radio network with worldwide listeners in over 120 countries. From our studio in Port Antonio, Jamaica, to the ears of the people in your community, our listeners can be your new customers. Styles FM is an economical, efficient, and effective advertising option for your business. No matter the size of your business, there's always growth potential. Styles FM provides the customer reach needed to realize that upward movement. So procrastinate no more. Advertising is a must. For more details on how to advertise with Styles FM, visit www.stylesfm.com or email info at stylesfm.com or call us on 876-518-2399. Styles FM, the world listens. Get your Saturday morning start to the right way. It's all about the jump start with Chungi, the Chinaman on your radio. From 6 a.m. to 9 a.m. It's all about fights from the start to the finish. We're more in a go that get diminished. So whether you're home, on the road, on a bus, or drive taxi then, come listen to Jump Start on Stars FM. We cover the globe like oxygen. Jump Start Saturdays, 6 to 9 a.m. That's at the time. Anything else me leave out? Sure. Never mind. Planning a party? 
club night out, stage show, a gospel concert, or even a business sales event, let Styles FM be a part of your promoting tool. Take advantage of our low price promotion packages with commercials, interviews, giveaways, reviews, and much more. We have special offers when you mix and match and bundle your options. Contact us at 876-286-9216 or 439-5160. Styles FM for the most effective way to exploit your marketing dollar. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, now offering stage, lighting, and trust systems for your small and medium-sized events. Whether it's a stage show, concert, drama play, wedding, street party, or club setting, you name it, we'll bring it to life. Call us at 871-5212 or 844-6531. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, a sponsor of In the Know of the Law with Sergeant Adele Rose Green and also Real Talk with Lady Cleo and Daddy Rude. Hello. Let me tell you something. A problem, you know, I get people, you know. Yeah, man, a problem, me. A problem, me. You know, me ask, Tama, you know. Right now, if me become incapable of servicing the woman, let me tell you, man, go on then, man. How that I go right now? White people, something that, you know. White people, something that, uncle, white people, I don't know, do them something there. Say, all right then. Oh, honey, tell you what, love. Gonna get yourself somebody else, yeah? And I uh, will stay here while you go get your intimate freak on. Yo, not Jamaican, you know, then there's something there. Why? All right, I'm gonna marry the something about the woman part me here. No. <laughs> something about that, saying Then the partner part, no. You only could do it now. X or X for a reason. Exa X a reason. Mm-hmm. And if you get wrong bang and you go to school, you gotta do over back your work, don't. But if you do over back your work with the command to a relationship, then a the problem that man because I see him road, you go down now. Why go change? No not all not change. If a person get richer, they more get wickeder. Then get poorer, the more stressed to death. So all of this right now just cheap or just cut. <laughs> Take no, if my man get the whole man pregnant, me have him in the picnic. But guess what? I don't know how I'm going to do it. Because my income and my kids, them, now go be short because of him mistake. Because he must be more precautious and smart into what he's doing. So, for me, they are that the child is innocent. But regardless, you have to take care of the kid. But don't charge you and me, because we're not going to accept that. From me, ex and more one partner, me no want him. Because they not know the rest of him make up for. Because definitely he no not know what he wants. So if we have an ex, we have multiple partners. There's no way I'm going to go there, because he doesn't know what he's, he needs. Or when he no have no way going, and he not sure what he want. So me not going back there, so real talk. No man has a coffee in another man to be servicing his woman. No way. Not, not going to be accepted. He might go try and find some source or some resources. But he's not going to be comfortable in that situation to know that another man is going to service a woman and a woman only doing housework, house chores to him. No way. <laughs> Real talk. Good to hear from Charmy there and the others. Uh, welcome back, guys. So we are going quickly to the Facebook Live connection. Yeah. Mm. Prestige. Oh, yeah, man. <laughs> I want to shout out to Herbert Mitchell. Big up a save every time. What's that? Alston Lopez. Every time. Nova Martin. We are going with up there in Illinois. Locked into Styles FM. Yeah, man. You know. Mm-hmm. Who else is up uh-huh. there? Herbert Mitchell? Yes. Locked yeah. in. Locked in. Every time. Mm-hmm. Every you time. Know? Because Over we still Herbert in and Nova. Colombia. Oh, British yeah. Columbia? No. Just Colombia? Um, San Andre, that little island okay. over there in Colombia. Okay, yeah. cool. And they same hang out, they same live. All Make right. Make up a safe every time, Herbert. Yeah, Real man. talk. Mm. Um, <clears throat> Devoy is expecting a baby? I don't know. Yeah, I think Anything he said he is. Oh, yeah, I said my youth. <laughs> yeah. So, of course, 
16th? Yeah. I don't think he's read 16. I think he's probably 10 or 9 by oh. this. Boy, my you um, can, can go through, man. Shutter. Yeah. Um, we can go through. Of course, there'll be a full, <laughs> it's a full surprise with a boy or girl. I guess they, they, yeah. they don't know. Yeah. They didn't want to know as yet. Yeah. So, Celine Brown, it is. Yeah. yeah. That's um, November 24 is the shower, you know. Oh, we are saying. So, you need to go because I won't be able to go, unfortunately, mm. because like I have an engagement. Yes. Yeah. Tomorrow, I'm a birthday, so I'm going to know if I go up and run in. Yes. Yeah. So, so it's, a, it's in the town know, at La Bess. The They're having nice yeah. big bashment. I recover. <laughs> <laughs> so I mean? go and celebrate with mm. Celine are we going? Brown and of course the boy. boy. I see you going. Guess my what? Youth. Boy, you take baby business like a hobby. A serious business. <laughs> She's loved all around. Of course, all her friends and family will be there, and yeah. the man of the hour will be there. Yeah. The man who planted the seed. Book of Solomon. I tell you, boy, Mr. <laughs> Solomon. <laughs> I, tell you. I hope she has a wonderful yeah. evening on Sunday. Mm-hmm. Mm. And <laughs> look here, in the man. We go back to our Vox Pop for a moment. And by the way, on Sunday, mm. I'll be in the pleasure. Well, I'll have the pleasure of being out um, at Fox's birthday bash. Yeah. Oh, Mansion Hillside on the beach. Yeah. Yeah, man. Nice party mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. yes excitement and celebration mm -hmm. and food and stuff and stuff and stuff and mm -hmm. stuff yes yeah. man so um if you want to be have a little a little get away from the town yes i'm invited you know i'm gonna see you out sunday? there yes man you know i can't come sunday sunday mm -hmm. what time 12 to 12 12 to 12 what yeah, time you'll so be here probably not two o'clock bells or so mm -hmm. yeah two three o'clock bells mm -hmm. Eat some nice food and steam fish and all these things and yeah, you know. Mm. Have a good little liming mm. on the beach kind of thing. But it's a, it's really a birthday thing, you know. So if you wanna get away and you wanna meet up and link up with Lady Cleo. Manchinil. Yeah, out that side there, yes, Sunday. along along the beach. Just mm. chillax and have some good, nice, you know, then do some nice fish out that side. Yeah, some yeah, nice man. stuff. Manchinil, yeah. And fish down. Mm hmm. Mm. Fisherman so, town, yeah. We're looking forward to that. Mm -hmm. Yes, I'm a plan for just eat and just eat and just eat. Mm. So, my invite, if you just come, come eat and eat and eat too. All to right. eat for the love and, you know, All just right. have a good vibration. Sunday. Yes, man. I want to see you in the bus. I want to see you. I want to see Yeah, man. And this gentleman here cook nice food. Mm. Curry good. What's about the let's say? Or the place, Pan, Foxes. Um, you said something about Yeah, but him uh, named Fox, but yeah. it's one beach named Belly's Beach. Belly's? Mm-hmm. Okay. On that side, so okay. it should mm. be good because he can mm. cook. Yeah. And nothing Belly's is beach. greater than a man who can cook. Ah. Like you, Prestige, I know you appreciate good food. Yeah, man. Real talk. Yeah, if you love curry. Yeah, yeah real man. talk. Mm. All right, what Sadie's saying now? I love to hear from Sadie, you know. Sadie's mm. saying, if me in the relationship for a long time and that happened clear, mm. Other way is there to make that man happy. Yes. Cleo, you mm. calm down, ya yeah, mama. Mm. That man don't know what he's saying. Mm. It's when woman going up in age, them love dancing. Mm. Tell him, ya yeah, it. Tell him. I will ah. say it. <laughs> <laughs> mama say it. At, you know, at girl, you know, I just love her so. I yeah, say tell you, boy. Yeah. Um... <laughs> Let's see who else is on the text line, dear Cassidy. And we want to go back to our. We want to go back to our Lady Grace. I want to hear what Grace is saying. Hey, Gracie over there in Atlanta, Georgia, my place. My, to my lovely, handsome, smoothie friend. I'm wishing you a happy birthday starting in 15 minutes. <laughs> Full joy of the day and many more. Love you, my brother. Oh, isn't that tweet? Oh, oh. super tweet. Oh, yes. that's coming from Lady Grace. Yes, and thank the you same very much, Lady Grace. Right back to you. Thank you very much, oh, my dear. I touched yeah. a while ago. <laughs> Watch it, Ain't Lady Grace. No good. Cleo. No. Ain't no good. <laughs> oh boy. Mm. Thank oh, you very geez, much, um, Lady Grace. Thank okay. you. Okay, thank you, um, the boy, Lord of His mercy. Oh, um, Ooh. I know the boy. We just chat too much. I know the boy. <laughs> mm. 
Thank you, the boy. Oh, you should have tell me. Yeah. You should have tell me. Yeah. People but it out. did say so, you know. Yeah. Oh, God, poor me. Yeah. All right. So I'm glad to. I'm yeah. glad to. Yeah. All right. Let's go back to the um, <laughs> Vox Pop. The Vox Pop um, Cassidy. And we share a little bit more because we have some more to share on it so the f from what we're gathering the men the average man out there except for dan dan who is on a different note all together i want to bright eye. yeah yeah bright eye. where you at what you doing eh? who you with why you can't answer? Why you can't call right there with a button <laughs> down you know button down good and proper like hurricane yeah. come want to charm Charm gave us a vox pop. We're not hearing oh. from Charm from with David, you know. Yeah. And we Lisa there. Yeah, one well, thing. Where is Lisa? Lisa? Yard vibes, bar. When, when Lisa, Daddy Rude there, you're, she cuts out him daylight. I want to Daddy Rude. Eh. You know, I don't take in button down, in button down too. Oh, in button down. Oh, you know what? Mm -hmm. uh, because of my idea. Oh. And him not like the idea. I mean, I think he like the idea because oh. when me share the idea with him, you know. Oh. Is that how I'm here? Was a. Uh huh. Uh huh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the idea we make well, him get caught up. Yeah, man, head space it, gone. It, it gone. Can't yeah. analyze. Yes. All of them stored in the part in the first part. So he oh. just can't talk. Oh. Right now, his lips oh. and tongue oh. are incapable of speaking. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. they can't provide no service right now. Yeah. So I'm quiet. Yeah. Yeah? Maybe. But I will catch him the next time I see him because the next time I see him, I want him to tell the listeners yeah. what him think about that part of the of the Vox Pop. Number we one. Yes, man, we yeah. want to hear from him. I don't know why I feel so every other night he must come call this show. Mm. Run up himself, pan we. Mm -hmm. Give us his big, big ideas, them. Mm -hmm. And get mad, pan we, if he want to get mad, pan me. Mm -hmm. Right? Or just talk the things, them, when he want to talk the things, them. Mm -hmm. But all of a sudden, tonight, no. Mm -hmm. Him just quiet. Talk because this one looking for six or for twelve. Talk to them, Lady Clear. I tell you. So, Cassidy. <laughs> no, can't go on like you know, no, so I can call so, you. What you say? Talk to the Both boss. the facts say your thing can't work. Yes. And the Chiquita mm. needs some assistance. Cassidy, not think across a line because he's <laughs> my young boy. You he would not no, think across a line. If you think about that thing, yeah. what if one day, God forbid. Mm. And the woman need help. You love her enough to help her. Make sure you get help, Cassidy, don't it? <laughs> Cassidy face yeah. looking at Cassidy me like... Yes. So she mm. can go out there and yeah. go get some help. Yeah, Cassidy say But yes. don't come back. Yeah. All right, uh, no, yeah. Say that to me, Cassidy. Say that to me. That, look here. <laughs> Is that right, Yai? Oh, who this? No, no, no. Who is this? No, 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 no. I'd rather on the hillside. They're done. <laughs> right, yeah, you heard our request for you to call in. Huh? You're just done. You're just finished. No, hey, you heard from me, though? Yes. I even time, six o'clock, you see? Yes. I'm reaching by the next morning, six o'clock. Oh, 12 hours. Let me turn from me, right, too. You understand me? Yes. Yeah. 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 So one, what, I'm reaching by the next morning, Every Friday night, every day, my lap goes style. Yes. yes. Real time. You understand me? Yeah. Yeah, man. So, more time now. We, we, um, it was the topic we had we, we, we the band tonight, you see? Mm-hmm. Okay, for me, for me, daughter, mother, call me. Right. Today, over to you. <laughs> yes. And I'm 18 years old since today. She go out to their parents. Yes. <laughs> and she come to Jamaica six years ago. Right. When she come to Jamaica six years ago, she don't want to thing with me. Like, but no one did not want to go on PR. Mm-hmm. No one did not go on PR. So I never got paid now. No, I just carry her, jump on her mother. And when she want me to come pick up, she call me. Hold on. We mean not not go on PR. <laughs> Eh? What do you mean nothing now going for? She never have no money? No, I yeah, never have no money them times. Her so so nice. sister filed PR. Yeah. So she sleep for her sister out. So nothing now going for her. If she want to work for her, she'll be her sister them times there, you know? Yeah. Oh. But now that things are going for her, you know? Mm-hmm. And she called me today and she knows the boy. She knows the boy. 
This number, they are touching the players. Yes. You understand me? And you want to know, it's like, she want me over to her, she want over to my area, she want to take over because you want to know. Mm-hmm. She have a, a young man in the state married to a man, she said, man, that died from cancer. Yeah. Leave her in her riches. Mm-hmm. You understand me? And so she come to Jamaica, December. And she was the woman who met me in the state. Mm-hmm. Right now, it's like the young lady we may have now. Yes. It's like you have to go step aside if I'm too much about the riches. Mm-hmm. More about the riches, you know, you understand? Mm-hmm. Lord Jesus. So, I'm going to work with her when she come. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, man, I work with her. So you're going to send out the other young lady? Huh? You're going to send out the other young lady? What again? You're going to send her away, the, fr- the lady now. You're going to put her on one side? To me, lady? Yes. The young man. What? The young man. Oh, you so craven. Huh? How long you know? Eh? Uh-huh. How long you know? Yes. I knew girl man. You understand me? I knew girl man. We just want to marry us. So don't talk about. Oh Jesus! Oh whoa. So she don't have feelings for you. She don't. She don't have feelings for you. Yes, man. This is crazy, crazy, crazy. Me I tell you, man. So why you gonna hurt the girl because you want a little legacy? Why you not sit down? I know that. I know that um. I attack. I say to her, I say, I'm going to find one. I'm going to find one, man. Mm-hmm. And the woman rich. And I want to work with the woman of foreign. And I ask you for the break to go. But take the opportunity there. Mm-hmm. Do you like me? How about she say? She say, if me really sit down and talk to her, and me not remember her, me, me not go forget her. She will not give me the, the, the green light. Oh. So they said to me, say, me find somebody. Me say, no, I want to break in my arm. <laughs> <laughs> I want to break in my arm and tell me, what the girl. Right there, you see the body. So, them. That almost call back. Me say, <laughs> so, you're telling me, you're going to give it a chance. Yeah, you're going to give it a chance. You think you're going to give it a chance? Well, you know what? 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 You know Yes. And me care when I have a, a, a work, do my lively daily bread. Yes, sir. Me care about the 700,000, I'm going to say the 30,000. Don't forget the quick money because of the operation. Yes, and she left you. I'm going to say, yes, I'm going to do the operation. Uh, one year after, one year after the girl did me. Yes. Yes, yeah, I'm me. this policeman, him and this policeman, I go on. I'm going to tell you that I'm going to and the policeman go to the funeral. What did tell me that the policeman is going to go to? Oh, wow. So you change from that time, you know, you, 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 your heart not go to, go to nobody again. I'm going to tell you that the policeman go to the funeral, pick them up, and when I go into the house the night and see the policeman and the woman from the bed, in a, a compromise, in what kind of a? Position. Position. <laughs> <laughs> With them, them, them position. Clear? Mm-hmm. Right there is a strong youth. Yes. And you never put her in a position there yet? I may have said it to the night in a week. Ah, whoa. Can you never put her in a position there yet? Eh? You never put her in a position there yet? You know? Hi. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> bright eye. So, why are you telling me that I'm going to come to Jamaica now? I'm going to tell you that 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 I'm going to
Mm-hmm. So you know me get hurt again, that's what you're saying. You know me come no more opportunity to miss you. Me know, you're yeah, not married to man. Oh. But, but, but if you know, if you meet that, that man, you should never ask for money now, me will take that. Mm-hmm. So tell me something, bright eye. Yeah. If you're something not work anymore, and you have a lady where, boy, she needs certain young, nice girl where, Ripe and in the heat at the, at, the, at the time, and you can't assist her. You're okay if she go find the help out there and come back. Like how you can go find help from a yes. foreign chick. Eh? Repeat that. No, me tell she she find somebody where she want go. She so you don't want her back? She can still stay the house and take care of you? You think you have to stay the house? Yes, we do the same way and look after you and wash your clothes and cook and all these things. No, go on, man. So oh, you want to get her and then she can go get help out there and come back? I'm not born there again. How are you again? I left me and left, man. Oh, you left? Yeah, man. <laughs> 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 so, press, uh, not prestige, um, bright eye. The other part of the Vox Pop is asking if it is that you have a lady and on a breakup as a case of your baby mother, you know, and yeah. she has several partners in between. You don't really take her back after years apart or months apart, despite how many partners she had. It's okay to get back with her good, good, and live with her again? No, I remember you one day again. So you have a lady and you and her separate for whatever reason to break off. And she have different, different partners while you were, break, you, you were, you were apart. No, I'm not going to go to the bottom pocket, man. I'm not going to man. Oh. But you really love her. You really love her and she love you. Gone. Oh. Okay. I see. I see, sir. I see. I see. It, and the woman there, I tell you, say, bright, I love the woman there. Oh. You understand me? Eh. Yeah, man. Say, my car, yeah. So, never again, then? I'm going to start driving up with people. Go start driving up with people, car. Eh. So, certain things yeah. not going for you again? Eh? Certain things you not do again? Yes. Clear. If you go up on me, if you go up on me, I tell you, say, never easy, I'm going to connect the car, you know, man. Eh. Real talk. Climb back which ladder? Oh, start over. Oh, yes. Oh, real talk. But she do you a favor, bright eye. Yeah. She did you a favor to man. Yeah. But you still love her still. Oh, we have to, man. Oh, real talk. Real talk, sir. We have a caller on overseas call. You hear bright eye? Yeah. yeah, man. Big up, man. Big up yourself every time, bright eye. Yeah. All right. Call her on the 954. Good night. Welcome to Real Talk. Good night. Good night. Good night. Chami, chami, chami. Long time. We don't have the nice time. How you do? Oh, she's a quiet fam night. Tired, tired, tired. I can Can't tell. Oh, boy. sh. Yes. What's going on for you tonight? We are, we are, we're coming up to the close anyway, so we're glad you chipped in. Me, I listen to Bright yeah. Yes, sir. Bright Bright yeah, so. <laughs> bright yeah, yeah, them bright them bad. The woman, them take them, kill them, come here and treat them bad. Mm. Because they, as they, you say, woman, they are foreign and them are come, they want them. They do that, do anything. You say, they have that one here before. One, they are foreign. 
And it really matter if he's with him before. He's been twice shy. You don't know man left him and come with a foreign. I left him too much years. And now I go tell him, I go left him a woman we have. This is a woman and he don't know where woman they are foreign to do. <laughs> that's not, that's not but guess what? You realize the bright not really concerned about what she up there do. Are they, are some of the money bright here you probably want? Craven choke puppy. Craven choke puppy. Bright here, you hear that? Craven choke puppy. So make it and then. Guy, you man, good have good have our little pig or yeah. Ah, oh. tell when she left come to me, a kind of trick and come down, but she not even know. Mm. Pray up to a puppy and you could all have one dollar because we go to Jamaica, they make bright eyes. Bright eyes, listen and right 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 take heed. A long time in a year already. Speak up. The woman left him already, met the woman turn. No, we don't do my riches. One woman rub you already and you go buy a tabu up for you. But you realize it. And, and cut straight. Cut straight but the, the thing is here. now too, from when we get from Bright oh, Eye, you know, yeah. Bright Eye, you know, really have no art towards nobody. So Bright Eye only a cut yeah. and go through, you know, put no art and soul, no nothing again. No, no, no. You can't make because of one bad relationship. True. You, you stop love and you stop be genuine and be real. That's true. You got to put that away and um, tell yourself that, oh, okay, everybody is different because people is people personality is different. True. And maybe this terrible person where you just look bit teared up. The next person may be genuine for you. Work with that person and achieve what you want. Nobody look found the, the, the material things out there, sir. Mm, true, true. Hit, uh, this woman is. And she know they can't tell you, say, you have your relationship where she went gone. She remember if this man never did. Mm. Where you would have did. She wouldn't have no eye for you. Yeah, we do. You have. Yes. So you have a bill man where you and this person have. Real talk. But you know, everybody's so different, charming. Everybody goes through the pain and the hurt differently. Maybe what he saw that night, him can't recover from it. Who knows? Mm -hmm. Well, listen to me. There is nothing there you can't because guess what? The fact that the matter that he's not dead, he can't move it along. I guess so. so. People, people go through worse than we can go through. True, 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 true. And they, 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 they pull back, right? You know, get no hurt, you know, get no scar. Yes, the pain and the hurt is there. But take that out and move along. Aye, yeah. real talk. Real talk. Yeah. All right, Charmy. All right. Baby. Good to hear from you, darling. Take it easy and get some rest, yeah? All right, guys, you know, guess what? It's 12 o'clock. We've come to the end of the show. Mm -hmm. Another interesting show indeed. Lovely hearing from y'all out Smiley. there in Radio Land. And, of course, it's the beginning of my co-host's birthday. And this is where I say happy birthday, Prestige. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, happy Happy birthday, birthday, Prestige. Happy. <laughs> Cassidy, I can't hope sing you mine. have a wonderful <laughs> day. Cassidy can sing today. Can sing my own. You need to get karaoke. All the very best yeah. to you, sir. Have a blessed birthday. Thank you very and much. And may you live to see countless more birthdays. Yes. And may you never age as you go through. Yeah. All right, so. Yeah. And, 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 and just living the life and. For my member to be there and to <laughs> reach 100. <laughs> <Up and running. laughs> yes, because you don't want to have to deal with anything crazy. No, we are getting phone calls uh, like crazy <laughs> now. Cleo, when is your birthday? Man was the 6th of November. Oh, yes. Mm. All right. Um, ail up to you too, my dear. Thanks much for being a part of the show. Carla, hello. Good night. The show done now. What are you saying now? Talk fast. You have one minute. Happy birthday. All right. Yeah. He Thank heard you, you my much. dear. He Thank heard you. Thank you very much. <laughs> my 20-year-old. All right, darling. Take care. <laughs> All yeah, right. Bye, so innocent. I tell you, yeah. boy. All right. So pretty much that's it for the show tonight, guys. On behalf of our engineer, Cassidy. The one and only Cassidy, videographer, pictographer, each other grapher.
engineer Graffa, yeah. Mm. That's the man to get for your videos, your interviews, your photo shooting as well, all right? And of course, on behalf of my co-host, mm -hmm. Prestige, yeah. who held it down for me 